Welcome in. How are we all doing today? I hope everybody's had a lovely Friday or is having a lovely Friday. You're nearly there. You're nearly at the weekend. So close. Uh, welcome in Baz. Welcome in Jerry. Uh, welcome in Gold. Good to see you. Okay, I thought we we're having a silent stream today. Yeah, I just let the uh, the rest of the music just play off and then I come in. Yeah, I just get too focused in the music. How are you doing today, Gold? Good to see you. Yeah, I've got all my little... Uh, whenever we've got the music playing, I need to communicate. I've got my little signs that I hold up. But yeah, I always let the music just play out. Uh, happy Friday to you all, so happy Friday. Uh, I'm looking forward to driving around Barcelona today. It's going to be nice, nice and relaxing. The lo-fi is working again, which I'm very happy about. It wasn't working yesterday. Oh my goodness, we've already been raided. <laughs> I just had it as well. I just had it up. Hello. Welcome raiders. How are we doing today? Jasper, thank you so much for protecting Super Earth, for democracy and all kinds of other things and reasons. Um, welcome in. How are you doing? How was your stream today? Zolna on Twitch. Good to see you. Welcome in. Um, yeah, let me... Uh... Welcome in raiders. If anybody needs to hydrate, get snacks, get away from screens, take your medications, please do. Self-care is very, very important. If it's anybody's first time here, why don't you tell me something about you? Let's get to know each other. Let's get to know each other. Listen to the disembodied voice. Let's get to know each other. If anybody is new, you want to tell me something about you, feel free to. We are driving around the mean streets of Barcelona today. But yeah, if anybody needs any post stream care, raiders, um, I mean viewers or streamer, please do. Please do. Let me uh, do that. We'll jump over here. Yeah, how was... Uh, how was Helldivers, Jasper? I hope it was a good experience. It looked like you were having a lot of fun. It looked like you were uh, kicking names and taking ass. I know what I said. I said what I said. Um, but yeah, if you need to post stream stuff, please do. Um, we're going to be playing this for like five and a bit hours today. We're just going to have it nice and relaxed. Lo-fi playing, Barcelona streets. We've got all the collectibles. We don't need to worry about that anymore. So we're just driving. We're just driving. We're just... Uh, uh, oh, please do, Gold. Please do. Yeah, we're just driving. We're just going to be picking up passengers. Maybe doing some of the challenges as well. But um, yeah, we're up to, uh, I think we've got a fleet of, is it three taxis now? I think we're up to three taxis. So uh, yeah, our empire continues to build. Zolna, how are you doing today? Were you working today? Are you working today? Um, I, do you have a normal weekend? Is Monday to Friday your week? And Saturday, Sunday your weekend? Because some people we know in this community work through Saturday, Sunday. And they've got like a Tuesday, Wednesday or a Wednesday, Thursday weekend. So yeah, hopefully everything's going well with you. Yeah, Gold, always happy to talk shop. Um, I'll do what I can. Yeah, let me know what the what the questions are. Um, yeah, should we start right where we right off with uh, picking somebody up? Let's start where we. Um, oh, we've got somebody right beside us. Okay, it's a pretty decent day, turn. Working for self care, no worries, sir. Jasper. You've done your duty today. Super Earth, thanks you. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we'll catch you soon. So I've been doing like a week of testing. Okay, the server in Dallas is closest to me, but if it fails, it seems perhaps I can turn off stream. So all I'm saying is that it feels like progress. Oh, this is good. Okay, I was I was poised for a question, but that's fantastic. I mean, Gold, look, let me let me just you know part the kimono here, and and well, well, if we're talking shop, let's talk shop. Oh, thank you for the uh, the YouTube sub. Uh, we do anonymous follows and anonymous subs here. Uh, feel free to, there it is. Feel free to join us on Twitch. We are, um, we're on both platforms at the same time, but thank you for the sub. I mean, gold, literally. <laughs> there could not have been a better moment for that YouTube sub to come in. I was literally about to say, we are meeting people on YouTube. We're doing it. We're doing the thing. We're meeting people on YouTube. 
So it just makes all the sense in the world, I think, to restream, I mean, to multi-stream. And I know you had the first time it didn't seem to work out, but I'm really glad you're progressing with it. It got gold 100%. Agree with you 100%. Other people have given me a million reasons why they wouldn't do it. And to me, I just don't really understand it. But the fact that we literally just got a YouTube sub as I was about to talk about YouTube subs and YouTube people. Um, we're meeting people on YouTube that are commuting over to Twitch as well, who are, who are choosing to, you know, the fact that I'm on both places, they're coming to follow on Twitch too. Um, it's happening. So yeah, seriously, just, just, yeah, I, I approve. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate. Uh, doing pretty good. Delivering meals. Almost done with my route. Cold, rainy, but my spirits are high. Though the spirits, my uh, my glass are pretty low. Probably see, though the spirits in my glass are pretty low. Probably seated that. Remember, don't drink and drive. Good calls, Olna. You deliver meals to people. That is fantastic. Very commendable work. I hope the rest of the day treats you well. And we will be here for another five hours. If you want to get some bit of um rest and relaxation, like I said, it's going to be driving around Barcelona today. Lo-fi music. Uh, I've been told my voice is quite soothing. So, uh, yeah, yeah, we'll be here for you. But congratulations on what you're doing and be safe. Be, <laughs> be safe with your journey. Sam, welcome in. Good to see you. Oh, Sam, um, so Jasper Toxifox plays Helldivers 2. And I said to them earlier, we need to get a Jenko Jasper co-stream <laughs> of the two of you playing Helldivers together. You can tell Jasper with your own voice all of your food shenanigans. Relive all the food stories. Uh, you know what? I'm glad we can be bottle bros and multi-stream bros. Gold, I feel, I feel, I've never felt closer to you. I hope everything just works really well for you. I really do. Um, yeah, it's, things are happening. It's, it was nothing on YouTube and now it's just, just winding up, just ramping up. So yeah, and we went past 500 YouTube followers as well. So we're on the route to, uh, we're on the road to um, YouTube sub. Um, and yeah, once we get 3000 watch hours on YouTube, we can be a YouTube sub. So we're getting there. Um, Abby, welcome in. How's your day? My dear, dear friend, are you, look, are you with a cat and a dog at the moment? Are they treating you well? Are they uh, giving you all the hugs? You're close. You're close, Gold. It's not quite a Hellboy shirt. It's a CM Punk Hell Froze Over shirt, but um, yeah, well spotted on, on the hell side. I must prepare for my kitchen um, mini series to be vocalized. You can, as you and Jasper, um, protect Super Earth for democracy and all of that. You can, um, yeah, you can tell me your stories, your, your kitchen war stories. Hester, welcome in. Welcome in, friend. How are you doing today? And everybody, I'll ask this question to everybody. Um, what's the plan for the weekend? And is there any food plans for the weekend as well? We need to know. We need to know. I'm loving all the cuddles I'm getting. Oh my, I can't wait for Mr. Rell to meet Laurie. I think that's going to be a big day. <laughs> that's going to be a big day. I'm excited. I'm excited for the stories. Um, yeah, I was, I had my concerns when Jonathan and Zaya were, uh, Potat Boy and Zaya were getting too close. And I, because Potat Boy is a big boy. I was worried they might, you know, be bumping into Zaya and stuff like that. But um, yeah, I'm glad the pets are behaving. Uh, I'm competing in an esports race on Saturday in Star Citizen. I'm thinking about making some Japanese curry for the weekend. I had some Thai curry two days ago. But Zolna, that is very exciting. I had no idea you were, um, I had no idea that was something you were into. Fantastic. Yeah, best of luck. Um, Gold will testify to this. We've seen a few races on Saturdays. <laughs> In, in the past several weekends. Um, yeah, yeah, people like to race on the weekends, apparently. But yeah, best of luck with it. On Monday, um, tell us how you did. Please jump back into the chat and uh, tell us how you did. Luckily, Ellie is a small pup, so she's easy to handle. Earl's too, <laughs> Earl's too lazy to be energetic. We're all Earl. We are all Earl. <laughs> Earl is us, we are Earl. Very intense races, yes. And I love the fact that you and Rob ate lasagna before you played the Garfield racing game. 
it was like it had to be done. It's like, have you seen... Um, it's always sunny in Philadelphia where they play Charlie McDennis. They drink, they, they, they very elegantly drink wine as like the... Um, it's like the opening ceremony. But then after they finish their wine, they smash the glasses. That's how they start. And something quite elegant. And the two of you just, you know, chowing down on your family-sized lasagnas before you raced. I thought it was too perfect. Got third in both competitions you were in. Zola, this is, this is fantastic. Third is very good. Very, very, very good. Did it give you the taste for more, though? Did it give you the taste for wanting something higher on the podium? I'm, I have all the faith in the world that you're going to do amazing this weekend. Good luck. On the day that my plumbing was out, I think I may have heard another part of that story. <laughs> At least I remember, was it? I think I asked you the, <laughs> I think I asked you a question. And then Rob, was it Rob that did a clip, a very perfectly timed clip? <laughs> I won't say what the question was that I asked you. But um, yeah, it could lend itself to that situation. It was very good, yeah. Yes, I think you remember the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, let's pick up our first passenger of the day. Can't be chit-chatting all day. I've got an empire to run. Metal crazy. Good to see you, friend. Good to see you. How are you? How's your day? Oh, I've got a handbrake on. We'll wait a little bit um, until a few more people come in. Then we'll do some um, shout-outs. I, I always want to do them at the beginning of stream, but I always think it's better to if I shout out people in front of more people. Hopefully the uh, it all it will go a bit further, you know, all the goodwill and uh, the, the clips will be seen by more people, etc. Oh, by the way, how common are taxis in the UK? Um, in, I mean, if we're talking about UK in general, you'll always find one outside of a train station. Don't worry, Zolna, I'll grab it in a second. But if, if you're in London, you'll see just a bajillion of them. Um, Oh, wait, gold, gold, gold. Now we have a gold emote. Uh, metal, metal. Long story short. Uh, the race, Super Dragon Tofu Rod. <laughs> Super Dragon Tofu Rod. Okay. Conceptually, you're a tofu delivery driver speeding across the town in a spaceship. My only desire was to survive, which I did amazing. Amazing. Um, sounds pretty good. Yeah, well, good luck for this weekend. Uh, okay, right. We're going to go and pick up a first person of the day. It's asking me to do a U-turn here. Is that safe? Should I be doing a U-turn here? Oh, um, by the way, just in case anybody isn't following me on YouTube, at 6 p.m. my time, which was seven minutes ago, I put out a really good YouTube short where um, so I was parked. My car was stationary. And somebody walked into my bonnet and I got penalized for killing them. So, yeah, go and check that uh, that clip out on YouTube. It's very good. Alex, welcome in. Uh, how are you doing today, Alex? Lovely to see you. Lovely to see you. What are your plans for the weekend? Before we begin, you must all be warned. Nothing here is vegetarian. Bon appétit. Bon appétit. There it is. I think, I, d I don't know how we're going to get through this traffic situation. I think we might be stuck here forever. The, all the lights are fine, I think. This person's indicating left. Yeah, we're, we're stuck here forever. I'm going to have to do some, uh, some maneuvers. We're having a cookout tonight. Nice, very excited. What's on the menu? There we go. Very carefully done. Very nimbly executed. Oh, this person's going to get killed if they're not careful. Right, shall I put on some lo-fi for us all? Let's all relax. Head of the weekend. Let's get the music up to a good level. What do we think about here? Oh, here we go. Battered chicken, twice cooked chips, and long stem broccoli with garden peas. LX. All sounds good. All sounds very appealing, but twice cooked chips. Seal of approval. Big fan of the concept. My friend was on a TV show. Uh, it's called Come Dine With Me. And uh, part of the thing he did was steak, and I think it was twice, twice cooked chips, and he won. He won the competition. 
I usually hate hot dogs, but we're having jalapeno cheddar hot dogs. Oh yeah. You two are both living life today. I'm, I'm very impressed. All homemade as well, Alex. Very good. Very good. Right, let's, let's, let's see if we can pick up our first clients of the day, shall we? Yeah, I was um, just saying to anybody coming in that I've got a YouTube short that's going up or that went up about 10 minutes ago. And it's somebody walking onto my bonnet. And um, that was, I got fined for it. They walked right onto my car. I was parked. They walked into my bonnet and I got the penalty, which is bullshit. McDonald's for dinner, Sam. Tell us what your McDonald's order is. This is a very big order. Prepare to be impressed, everyone. Sam likes to go large when they go to McDonald's. It's quite something. It's quite something. We're going to need to know, Sam. I like a McChicken sandwich meal when I go to McDonald's. Something in that mayonnaise, I swear to God. Something in that mayo. Right, where are we going? I think I think we can quickly reverse out here without being hit. Okay. Okay. We're on the road. Uh, I hurt all over. I'm trying to read chat while looking. I hurt all over. And I'm so tired, but I have a I have had a productive evening. Alex, that's fantastic. That's absolutely fantastic. So are you rewarding yourself with this dinner? Because as I always say to people with chronic issues or to anybody really, if you've got something to do in the day, um, try and bribe yourself to get through it. If you've got to be productive, reward yourself afterwards. It's very important. Two double cheeseburgers, large six chicken nugget meal, mozzarella dippers, share box, sometimes a Big Mac and a McFlurry cream egg. Very good. I like a McFlurry. I don't know if I'd have a McFlurry cream egg, but I do like a McFlurry. Yeah. Oh, what the fuck was that? Did you see that? Sam, did you see that? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> We're going to need to check the tapes on that one. We are going to need to check the tapes on that one. Fuck. Thank you, Sam. Woo. Dang, Sam, that is more than me. I usually get two triple cheeseburgers, 20 nuggets, and two McChicken. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that sounds really good. I could go with two McChicken right now. Jerry, two McChicken sandwich meals. Oh, yes. I saw that. All right, good lad. Intel, welcome in. Uh, when are we beginning Mafia 2? I remembered what game it was today. I was looking at my uh, my own trophies today and went past Mafia 2. I think I have the remaster as well, or the remake. I've just never played it. That was a wild, wild, wild crash. Oh, Horizon Forbidden West, nice. What are we thinking? What's the review so far? Let's quickly go around here, nice and safe. Nice and safe, oh. Easy. Oh, more pedestrians trying to kill themselves. Best looking game I've played today, Intel, it's my so I, for Horizon Forbidden West, I'm on record as saying they are the best looking character models in gaming that I've ever played. I, I have Ghost of Tsushima as the best world, best looking world I've ever played. But the character models, if you look close at Aloy's face, you can see the rosacea in her cheeks. Best looking character models ever. I can't quite believe the graphics I'm looking at. It's fun so far. I'm only an hour in. Yeah, I'm hoping you're going to have a really, really, really good time. I've never played the first one, never played the third one either. Um, is this guy going to cross or not? There we go. Perfect. Yeah, I had a good time with it. I should probably return to that franchise at some point. Maybe I'll play the uh, the entire trilogy. Different from my boys. I think you've done them proud, Alex. I think you've done them absolutely proud. Of them. Were they happy? So I would, I would be very happy if that was served to me. But um, kids can be... Kids can be something. But I'm hoping they loved it. The snake robots look scary, but fucking bad. Oh, yeah. I know exactly the part of the game you're referring to. Yeah, they're good. 
you get some um, some pretty interesting machines in that neck of the woods. Just want to say hello to all the lurkers out there. Uh, we appreciate you. I assume Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Next week we will be playing Rise of the Ronin. Just a quick uh, quick sneak peek. Rise of the Ronin did arrive today. We're going to be playing this Monday, Tuesday, potentially Wednesday. Seeing what I think of it. Um, and Thursday, Friday, we're playing Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. But yeah, here it is. It has arrived. Rise of the Ronin. <clears throat> there wasn't anything left bar some peas. That sounds like a win to me, Alex. <clears throat> that sounds like success. Have fun with text life. Intel, I appreciate you. Have a good time. We got up to 850 lurk hours on YouTube as well. So we are slowly moving towards YouTube partner. Oh, it's 70 miles per hour here. I'll try and go a bit quicker, but I don't want to break the speed limits. Because I will get punished if I break the speed limits. Sam, is the volume good for the music? Volume is good, dude. Nice. Thank you. How's the third assignment going? Perfect volume to me too. Perfect. And Alex as well. Good, good, good. That's what we like to hear. Hopefully the music doesn't break today. So far, so good. Oh, pedestrian crossing the road. Let's be careful. Yeah, Sam, we had some flying cars yesterday in the game. I didn't get any clips, though. But um, I did get a good clip of somebody just basically throwing themselves on my bonnet. So very boring. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Is it the third of three assignments, though? Is this the final one? You're nearly there. You can nearly get back to your streaming. You need to get back to all your stream watching. Close. Three of five. Oh, shit. Well, you're over halfway. That's one way to look at it. Over halfway. We got four trophies in this yesterday. I'm hoping to get a few more today, actually. I think we've got a good understanding what kind of trophies are in this game. There are trophies for levels. I'm currently level 16. There are trophies for amounts of passengers you take. Uh, I think the last trophy we got for that was taking 25 passengers. And we get trophies for distance driven as well. So, as I mean, basically, you just got to drive. And those three types of trophies will keep ticking down. We also got a trophy for going to all of the um, petrol stations. So I'm going to try and use all of the pa um, car washes today, if I can. That presumably could be a trophy. This is me trying to deduce trophies rather than looking them up. Okay, we're nearly there. I'm definitely better at driving in this game than I am in real life. Can confirm. Bless me. Thank you, Abby. Went past 850 hours, Abby, on YouTube. Another big landmark achieved. Thank you, Sam. 
I think uh, Jerry and Cole do most of those hours between them. They're pulling some big numbers, and I appreciate it. Oh, I see you, pedestrian. Don't try it with me. I'm going to try not to kill anybody today. If I can help it. On the 15th of May, so not too far away. You've got, you got plenty of time, thankfully. Uh, 3,000. If we get 3,000 live watch hours, um, we can become a YouTube partner. We're up to 850. But we have a whole year to do it, so we've got ages. It's just uh, it's a bit of a slow burn. But yeah, then I can get things like uh, Super Chats. I can advertise my merch on YouTube. Uh, and then that's one step closer to getting paid adverts in all of my uh, videos as well. And I've got nearly 900 videos on YouTube, so they will all be paid content. Um, like they'll have adverts is what I mean. So yeah, it could be a little money maker. You never know. Alex, I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, we'll get in there. Abby, I had such a, sur <laughs> such a surreal moment yesterday in somebody else's chat. I'm not, I can't say any details. I can't say whose chat it was or who it was, but there was somebody very special in there. A huge YouTuber was in there. And I was like, I didn't say anything. I wanted to, but I was so like, I don't know if, I mean, probably starstruck is the right word, but like, I was, I just couldn't believe it. I could not believe it. Now that's got to be five five stars. It's got to be. I was I was perfect. I was absolutely perfect. Five stars. Ooh, okay. Using blinkers, good. Speed limit bonus. Respect the area is not available to cars. No small collisions, no big collisions. Driving against the traffic flow. I'm not entirely sure where I did that, but I'll take it still. I will take it. Uh, okay. Let me look at some good money there as well. Let me look at the map and let's see who we can pick up next. We could try doing a challenge. Could do a challenge run. Um, what about here? Let's go here first. I think we need to do some um, upgrades. So not upgrades, I mean... Um, I mean refueling. And why, why is the marker not appearing on my map? I'm trying to highlight this petrol station and it won't. It won't appear on the map, which is annoying. So yeah, I think we need to, you can't see it because it's behind my head, unfortunately. We're about um, about half a tank petrol wise. And we can we could do to wash it as well. Washing's not too bad. Uh, so the cleanliness level's not too bad, but we can do better. Why can I not? So I can I can pick up passengers, but I can't I can't click on the I'll click on these. That's a bit annoying. Uh, cancel away points. Cancel task. There we go. I don't know why, but it, it's working now. I'm not sure why that happened. Oh, am I going the wrong way? But this was. Hmm. Somehow this is one way now. Um, I'm confused. I think I'm in a one way system that I can't figure out at the moment. All right, let's go this way instead. Police car in front, so let's be uh, let's play it cool, everybody. Play it really cool. Nice and cool.
So it wants me to go straight over. I think I took a right hand turning there last time. We're meant to go this way. But it just looked one way. It looked one way. Some of these streets are a little bit narrow. Gotta be careful. Shannon, hello Shannon. How are you friend? Good to see you. We're playing a different kind of car game to the car game that you like to play today. But a car game nonetheless, how are you? I, I took your quote, Shannon. It made me so happy. And I put it in the announcement section of my Discord. Um, so yeah, thank you for what you said. You may have forgotten what you said, but thank you. For... Anyway, let me start by doing some shout outs. We'll start with Shannon. How was your week going? I was lurking a little bit. Uh, was it yesterday? The last time you were doing some, uh, doing some Crash Bandicoots? Just made my dinner, so chilling here while I eat. Now, have we had any um, feedback for the pain and the fatigue, Shannon? I can't lie, I've been thinking about what you said all week. That's that thing as well. I know you're waiting for some answers. Did we get any answers? Mm! What the actual fuck? <laughs> what the actual fuck? I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> Shannon, we swear here all the fucking time, so don't worry about it. There's Into it, and then we got Jasper raided in a little while ago. Oh my god. Uh, Gold was here. My cat. Abby was here. <laughs> what do you want? Jenko's here. I'm mid game, bro. I think that's everybody. I will put our path. Really? Now what Shannon, the Chris? All I can tell Why? You, all I can tell you, Shannon, is that we've got probably 15, 15 people in the community with Firebro. So if you've got Firebro, I can recommend a shit ton of people to talk to you about well? Firebro. Obviously, you've got doctors to talk to, we but if you need people to give to you actual day in, day out advice, I'm I can give you so many people in this community to have fire. We gather people, the, you know, the good and the great the of the, uh, the chronic way. world, the ill it world. Is okay and I can, yeah, because I got a load of people with fire. It's all in the name of play. I feel like one of those people, you know. Selling watches, you know. Oh, you, oh you need fire, bro. You need fire, but you need chronics. I got you chronics. <laughs> they got all of us. Oh, here, I'm Are you on, you're on the boat. Yeah, I, got it. I was about to. Oh, oh my, my god. god! I've not seen this clip before, Abby. <laughs> great laugh again, Abby. Great laugh. Heavy. Sam being a bit of lies with PP. Is that the something no, watchman? No, no, I forget no, 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 what that no, one's no, name is. Today. Not today. But yeah, Shannon, if there's anything we can do to help you, this community is at your beck and call. It's how we operate. Abby does have a great laugh, yeah. We kept getting struck. <laughs> we just kept getting struck by lightning. Just kept getting struck by lightning. Oh, rode the pavement there a little bit. Just a little bit. It'll buff out, I'm sure. It's weird, hoping to get a diagnosis so then I can know how to better manage things. But also very scared of getting a diagnosis and knowing that this will be my life forever. Shannon, as somebody that has had uh, more this will be my life now forever diagnoses than I can remember, it's okay. It's okay. The it, I don't want to make you sound make it sound like you're not a delicate and unique snowflake. But lots of people have fibro and they live full and happy lives. Yeah, they're in they're in pain. But it's not a you know. There, there, there are people out there that can help you, both in the medical professional world and in the Twitch world as well. Um, but don't worry. Don't worry, stay positive. But I can tell you answers are better than no answers. I believe that. Sometimes you get scary answers, but answers are always better than no answers. That's what I believe anyway. We are here for you. I'm glad you found us, Shannon. I'll, I'll say, I'm glad you found us anyway. 
But um, I'm glad you found this considering the, the, the help that our fibro people can potentially give you. Um, Okay, we're nearly there, we're nearly at the petrol station. That's the only loud part about me. <laughs> I'm liking this music. Weird how that works, yeah. Fate. It's fate, Shannon. Uh, oh, we can go in here like this. Right, so we'll wash the car and then we'll refuel. Okay. Jerry, thank you for the YouTube lurk. I appreciate it. We aren't all chronics, but we, were, but we are all... A cuties. We are all cuties indeed. Yeah, you don't have to, it's like that old saying, you know, you don't have to be chronic to work here, but it helps. It, well, I, I mean, that's not what the saying is, but that's what I'm going to make the saying for this community. You don't have to be chronic to be here, but it helps. Uh, yeah, so just in case people don't know, we have got up to 850 watch hours on YouTube. Live watch hours. So we're creeping towards the big 1000. When we get 3,000, we can be YouTube partner. Got it, we've done everything else. Just need those watch hours. So yeah, All right, let's do a full wash. What's your plan for the weekend, Shannon? I think you, you stream one day of the weekend. So I might sweep in and say hello. We are Shannon, yes, unfortunately. Yeah, thanks for reminding me about that. Uh, right, okay. Like, yeah, 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 okay. I think we do need petrol as well. So can I just reverse into the petrol station? It's Barcelona. I don't know if it's really like this. I presume it is, but it's all so one way in this game. Sometimes you've got to be really careful what you're doing. I may not this weekend. Pain is very bad at the moment. I'm sitting in one spot for a long time. Uh, gonna play it by ear. Good call, Shannon. Good call. Yeah. Um, all right, fill her up. Fill her up. All right, so let me take a quick look. So, again, I'm only presuming this, but we got a trophy yesterday for using all the petrol stations. So I think we're going to probably um, get a trophy for using all the, the car washes. So I'm going to say that this wash now has been, we've used this one here. I can't draw circles because we get locking on things, but I'm trying to draw a circle here. This one is done. So the next petrol station would be, I'm gonna put a marker here. We know we don't need it yet, but if we need to clean or um, fill up our car, we're gonna go to this one. One by one, we'll make our way through the city. Yes. Yeah, I mean, we, we've, the thing, nothing brings me more joy, Abby, that when people come here independently of each other and then find somebody that's going through something they're going through. I know you knew each other before being here, but. We had two people last night who um, found out they have something very unique in common. And yeah, if we can ever put people in touch with other people that can help either just be, be somebody to talk to or actually give actionable, non-professional advice on how to cope with pain, how to cope with this, how to cope with that. Yeah, that's that's kind of a big thing I want to happen here. I was I market this place as like a, you know, a place for chronic people to, to meet chronic people and to feel accepted. So yeah, it always makes me really happy when that happens. Okay, right, next passenger, you. Eleanor Wood. Abby, this is you. And this is you, Abby. Right, so we filled up our car. Okay, we actually need to make a bit of money. We're, we're spending a lot of money on... Um... Like cleaning our car and filling it up with petrol. We're, we're losing money now. Yeah, we're... You know, wits, it's not just me. It takes a village. So I'm glad I found some nice villagers to share the experience with. 
But yeah, I think another thing I want to make very clear, and obviously this is very self-serving because I'm asking you to bring people here. But when I tell you, if you ever meet people in other, ch other streams or other chats that are chronic, please consider bringing them here because they may not have anybody to talk to. They may not know about places like this. So yeah, I just think it's very important that we find the people that need to be found, you know. All right, let's go through here. Right, Eleanor. Oh, I'm on the wrong side of the road. <laughs> yeah, I was on the wrong side of the road. I hit the bump. I hit this bump. I launched me slightly left. So yeah, that was a great that was a great uh, 10 seconds of driving there. What a pro. And my car is not too damaged, not too damaged, but yeah, that wasn't ideal. I need to remember what side of the road I'm driving on in this game. I better be a good passenger. Dude, I feel like I need to get my car repaired just to pick you up now. Go all the way up and then come all the way back down. Yeah, I need to hit these bumps a little bit slower. I think that's what my problem was. I launched myself into the other car. Has anybody been following the um, Kate Middleton drama, by the way? I find it fascinating that they're basically missing right now. They're one of the most high profile people on planet Earth and they're essentially missing. It scares me even in the game, it's the same. I frequently will say, oh, yeah, wrong side of the road. <laughs> I couldn't quite course correct in time. Yeah, step one, but that picture, that doesn't look like Kate. It looks like an actor. Are you, are you talking about that picture? Because that's not Kate Middleton. It's it's him, but it's not her. I think it's a stand-in. I, I do not think that's her. She put out a video statement today? Oh, perfect. Fantastic. Yeah, I've not seen that. I was talking about that with somebody last... Oh. Are you serious? Oh. Can you imagine two people being diagnosed within she's undergoing chemo? Oh. I mean, that family, I would abolish the monarchy tomorrow, I'm sorry to say, but like. That is just the worst luck in the world. That is the worst luck in the world. The, 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 the future Queen of England. I can't believe it. I've not seen that. I've not, it's not on the UK web um, news channels. Yeah, I was talking to somebody last night about all our conspiracy theories. Didn't say. Uh, Kate Middleton has cancer. They haven't told us what cancer Charles has, and they haven't told us what cancer Kate has. That's unbelievable. Yeah, I eat that picture though that they put that came out. Um, yeah, me neither. That picture that came out was it like five days ago? This whole time I've been saying I don't think that's Kate. It does not look like Kate. But yeah, that that is so sad. Can't believe it. So um, Charles went in for regular like regulation some kind of regulation procedure. Uh, they found the cancer then, and she's gone in for like potentially a regulation procedure and they found the cancer as well. So that is just, oh, it's unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah. My driving's gonna be a bit shitty for the next five minutes as I process this, but yeah. I wasn't even following it in the first place because I'm not really a Royal fan. It's Shannon, neither am I. That's genuinely awful, yeah. Neither am I. Uh, that pick at the farm and the farmer's market video were odd at best. Yeah, maybe they it was a stand-in because they weren't ready to make the, the big announcement yet. Uh, if you can whisper it to me or if you can like um, send it to me on Discord as well, um, I'll probably forget it by the time by the time the stream ends. But yeah, god damn it, that's that's wild. Well, 
Well, I don't. I think all the conspiracy theorists were all. <laughs> I don't think anybody had that on the bingo card. Right, we're picking up Abby. Yeah, no, Shannon, between me and you, I'd abolish the monarchy tomorrow. I just think it's a very outdated concept, but yeah, that's that's tragic. I I know this from from uh, first-hand experience. We've got some pretty decent cancer hospitals in the UK. Mayhem Magpie. Mayhem Magpie, thank you so much for the raid. How are you? How are we doing? Wait a minute, let's go over here. Hello. Time for the Burb, uh, Burb Nest Raid, bringing the Burb Nest feathery fun. I come to throw burbs and run. Time for a Bird Nest Raid, bringing the Burb Nest feathery fun. I have to do the eat, no worries. Wait one second though, let me show you this. My new um, ventriloquism act. Welcome in raiders. If anybody needs to hydrate, get snacks, get away from screens, take your medications, please do. Self care is very, very important. If it's anybody's first time here, why don't you tell me something about you? Let's get to know each other. There we go. Hopefully I've got the uh, music back to where it was. Let me know, guys. Um, thank you so much for the raid. Um, go and do what you need to do. Uh, eat, drink, be merry. Best ever act. Yeah, I did it while drinking a bottle of water yesterday. <laughs> Big, lovely to see you. Um, how are we all doing? Um, pen dragon, Kel, Kel dragon, Cell pen dragon, welcome in. And you today was, how are you today? Welcome in. Um, I like to play games through to platinum. Everything else was said by the disembodied version of me. But um, yeah, how are we all doing? Um, uh, cell, is it Cell Pen Dragon? Like, as in cell shading? Cell Pen Dragon? Tell me something about you. Let's get to know each other. I appreciate you. Good day, sir. I said good day, sir. Right, cell is fine. Cell, nice to meet you. Uh, whereabouts are you from? What kind of games you like to play? Tell me something about you. Let's get to know each other. Uh, I will leave that. Okay, thank you, Mayhem Magpie. I appreciate it. Yeah, and B, how are you doing today? It's lovely to see you. That's such a tongue twister of a raid message, but I love it. It is indeed. Let me do a shout out as well. Busy with the uni stuff, hence me not being around much. Well, as somebody that went to university four times, I had to, um, the fourth time COVID stopped me from graduating. But um, yeah, I love university. So I hope everything's going really, really, really well. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. We've got another Swedish person. We've got so many Swedish people here and we love the Swedish people. Missy, Gibsy, uh, Tig uh, Tigara. They're all Swedish. Oh, they're going to love you. They, um, Missy and Gibsy alternate on Swedish word of the day. They're going to love you. That I'm so glad you're here. We're really establishing a great Swedish community here. Gibsy, we've... We We've met somebody else that's Swedish. Cell Pendragon. Cell is Swedish. Cell Gibsy. I'd like you, to, you two to meet each other. Um, Missy will be here later. And Tigara might be here later as well. Yeah, Gibsy and Missy do Swedish word of the day for us. Um, have I missed anything? If I missed anything, please don't feel, um, don't worry about throwing it back in. Lots is happening in uh, the chat right now. I play different RPG games. Very nice. Very nice. You're very welcome here. Uh, I was eating, but I hope everything goes well for Kate. Yes. Yes, indeed. Yeah. I'm going to have to do a lot of research into that later. Yeah. I'm so sorry to hear that. Came in wrong. Hold on. <laughs> this is Gibbsy's walk-on message. But yeah, sell. Seriously. I, we're getting so many wonderful Swedish people here. Oh, yeah. I meant to do a shout-out, wasn't I? We will do a shout-out. There we go. Mayhem is from the UK. If anybody's looking for any more UK people God, to follow. God, that's hell. <laughs> um? look, look, Claire, look at your eyes. Uh, LX, thank you so much for the lurk. Oh, I appreciate sweet it. I appreciate it. I'm in a cage. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh, a little oh, bit of oh, phasma here. Naked? So, yeah, if you're just coming in Raiders, we're playing some uh, Taxi <laughs> Life, a city Dude. driving Dude. simulator. I think that's what it's called. Yeah. Let me go back over here. So yeah, we're driving around Barcelona, having a really nice time. Um, yeah, so what are you studying, um, B? Have you told me? 
You may have told me in the past. I'm sorry if I forgot. But yeah, good luck with all the uni stuff. Right, let's go. Let's continue our, our journey. We've just picked up Abby, uh, aka Tube Sock. So we're taking Tube Sock wherever they need to go. Going to try and make it a five out of five star journey. And hopefully we'll get a nice tip. Abby might give us the tip if we're lucky. Oh, police car up ahead. Easy, easy, easy. I better. Uh, we're not going too fast. We're trying to be careful. Oh, yellow lights. Let's park up here. Don't want to run a red. SD stream title today, by the way. Air hump. Thank you, Gibbsy. Let's go. Ooh, I see you, pedestrian. I see you, pedestrian. Oh, by the way, uh, just in case you didn't hear me when I said this earlier, we've put... Uh, the oh, the radio. Nobody's ever asked me to do that before. It kind of scares me slightly because I worry that it's um, music I can't, I can't use while streaming. Thanks. Shall I put the game volume on zero just in case? Yeah. Here we go. Yeah, sorry, just when I, um, if you didn't hear me when I said this earlier, I just put out a new YouTube short from yesterday's stream where a guy just walked into my car and I got, I got told off for, for killing them. Even though they came at me, I was the victim. It's going pretty well, actually, yeah. I had a little bit of fish earlier. I had pie as well. That's very nice. What kind of logic is that, Mitch? I do not know. They told me that I get, um, they gave me a penalty of $70 and said, if every, if I get it for every time I, I run a pedestrian over. But I was parked, I was stationary. So if anybody wants to see that happen, I just put out a YouTube short about 30 minutes ago. So yeah, it's annoying. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was the other one. I couldn't find that one when I went back through the VOD, though. All right, so far, so good with Abby. I think we're nearly at the destination. Nobody has died along the way. I think we've been pretty good with the uh, speed limits. Maybe could have indicated there as well. Oh, rode the curb. That might bump me down slightly. He's playing Elden Ring, nice. Tell him hello. And, and please thank him. Tell him we went past 850 on, on the YouTubes, and I appreciate him. 
Did you, after 13 hours in total, I watched you play a bit of it, was it yesterday? I didn't see you get it, but um, yeah, that's amazing. Congrats. That is dedication. It's one of my favorite tracks, actually. It's one of my favorite tracks. Wednesday Nice. Yeah, I really, really, really like that track back on the PlayStation 1 as well. Right. Abby, we are reaching your destination. I think I'm going to get marked down for... I forget what it's called, but it's like going where the car shouldn't. It's that one. She rode, re rode a couple of curbs. But I think we did okay. There we go. Five star. Ooh, hold on a second. What do we get? Successfully complete 50 rides. Okay. Abby, forever you'll be associated with this trophy. Forever Abby will be associated with this trophy. Looks like I went to the next. <laughs> Perfect. This was you, Abby. This was you. I think there is a bronze um, emote now. A BTTV bronze emote. And there's a silver and a gold and a bronze. Sorry, a silver, a gold and a platinum. So uh, yeah, feel free to chuck a few of those in. That wasn't too bad, actually. Abby, you, you did give us the tip as well. 34 euros of a tip. Nice. Okay. Nice. Good to start off with a trophy. We got four in this game yesterday. They're not too difficult, I don't think. Um, right, we're in this neck of the woods. So I'm, like I said, I'm going to try and use all of the, um, the car washers today. Um, okay, let's take the brake off. Let's go and wash the car, even though it's not particularly dirty. I don't think it needs to be particularly dirty. And there's not a flat fee. You pay for the amount of wash that you use. So we're not going to use a bunch of money, but it's it's not 100% clean, so we'll go back. Oh, I can turn the radio off now, can't I? I think that's probably the best thing to do because I'm not sure if the music is copyright or not. There we go. And I'll turn the game volume back up slightly. Not that anything particularly ha exciting happens with the game volume. Um, oh, by the way, Abby, can you let me know if the music is a good volume? Because I had to put it down during the raid and I put it back up. I think I put it back to the right place, but I might not have done. All right, let's turn here. Shannon, we had so many flying cars in this game yesterday. It was amazing. I felt like we were living in the year 2070. Haven't seen any today so far, but um, we'll keep our eyes peeled. We have, <laughs> we've had a really weird AI thing happen today though, where a car just seemed to crash into nothing and flip across the road. So that was fun. I think, I can imagine they will be one day. I, I can, like, it just makes, it'd be hard to police it. Um, just a, quite a boring chicken begin, pie, Gibson. Nothing too exciting, unfortunately. It wasn't Nothing even that you. nice, truth be told. It wasn't the normal pie I get. I like to get a well, Marks and Spencer's pie, if I can. Um, they're, they're kind of high-end Marks and Spencer's, but like I always tell people, I've got no pets. I've got no kids. I've got no drug addictions. So uh, I will get a Mark, Marks and Spencer's pie every now and again. <laughs> it's where all my money goes. Nice food. You'd have to have roads in the air to make it safe, surely, like pilots have. I don't know. I think there'd be a max height you could go. Um, yeah, I, I, I think in the beginning there would be so few of them. Does that make sense? That in the beginning you'd probably not see anybody else flying for like, if you drove for like 30 minutes, you might occasionally see one person, but you'd have to have so many... You'd have to have like sensors the whole way around the car saying there is somebody to the east. Like, bear that in mind. They're coming in quite quickly. So just, just you know, 
Maybe they'd be like driverless flying cars, do we think? Might take some of the guesswork out of it. Maybe they'd be like bumper cars as well, with like big rubber sides. So if they bumped into each other, there'd be no no damage. They just like bounce off. It'd be a disaster. <laughs> I mean, probably. Probably, yeah. Would have to be automatic, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, we want this one, don't we? Right, let's wash this car, even though it's not that dirty. How do we how do we pull in? Where's the Where do we turn in? Is it around here? Wait a minute, how do we I'm get in there? I'm a soup slut. I am a soup slut, yeah. How do we get in there? I think I've missed the turning. Oh. That was very close. Where was the turning? Was I supposed to go here? And then here? Yeah, I think I was. Right, so let's go here. Car wash. Uh, yeah, it's very clean as you can see, but we'll wash it anyway. Okay, that was only eight euro. No, not too bad. Right, where's the next one for when we're when our car's vaguely dirty? Again, not super duper dirty. So we've done this one today. Done this one today. Maybe here. Yeah, potentially here. I'll mark you down. Nibon, hello. Good morning to you. How was your day going? What are the plans? And have you had any good food? We need to know, Nibon. Good to see you, though. Right, who's going to be our next passenger? Nibon, this is you. This is you. Let's go pick up Nibon. How do I get the fuck out of here, though? Is it this way? Wait, is this one way? No, it's not one way, okay. It, that's a question that I ask myself many times during a stream. Is this one way when I play this game? There we go, right. Safe and sound, nice and clean. Going to the beach this afternoon. As for good food, just the salad. How's the taxi driving going? It's going pretty well. Um, we saw some flying cars yesterday. Nothing quite so exciting today. But um, we picked up our 50th passenger and we got a trophy for it. So yeah, nice little start to the stream. Uh, okay, let's go and pick up Nibon. I think I'm meant to be in this lane. Good, didn't get rear-ended. Oh, is it here? Yeah, okay, it's here. I was gonna go down there, but I think it's this is the one, yep. Okay. Don't you cross the road. Don't you, don't you do it. I'm scared for a second. People in this game, they really do crave death. The, uh, the pedestrians. So you've got to be careful. You've got to be careful. Let me just check is the... Oh, Abby, did you let me know about the, um, the music volume, volume, by the way? Driving in the city would stress me out. Driving, period, would stress me out. Yeah, we had to um, just change the volume when the raid came in. So I put it back to where I think it was. But if someone can let me know if the game volume... Sorry, the um, the music volume's good. The lo-fi. These little side streets, the pedestrians just love to just shoot out. Sounds good to me. Good. They love to just shoot out at the last second. When you least expect it. Are you crossing or are you not crossing? You're not crossing, okay. Oh, easy now. Easy. Oh, now everybody wants the cross. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now everybody wants the cross. 
Okay, I think we're safe. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, this dude just turned around. Make up your mind, sir. Make up thy mind. Okay, here's Nibon. Jump in, Nibon. There you go, that's you, Nibon. I haven't had a conversation with anybody today so far. Looks just like me, perfect. Yeah, the Albert Einstein looking ones are either uh, Gibbsy or Missy. He said, if I ever see Christ again, he's a dead man. <laughs> Do you know what? I was watching some Philomena Kunk today, Gibbsy. I actually was. I might have to make some more sound alerts. I might have to. I might need to go back through the archives and see what I can find. It's, it's all too good. You just need the whole episode as a, as a, as a shout out, as a command. Oh, 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 oh. easy, easy. I love them, yeah. I, I think we're going to do a big watch along, Gibbsy, in Discord at some point next week. And it's all on the BBC. Well, a lot of it's on the BBC. So I know I can stream things from the BBC. Um, so Nibon, truth be told, before COVID, I was on it all day, every day. Buses, trains. Uh, I'd go to London to watch the football on the train very frequently. My life is still not quite back to where it needs to be post-COVID. So not really anymore, but um, I will at some point. But yeah, um, you could say I'm on a hiatus at the moment. Uh, what about everybody else in the uh, community? Do you guys like to use public transport? Is it something that scares you? Is it something available to you? I know it can be very expensive, and I've been told there are parts of America where like trains are just nowhere to be found, like locally, I mean. Dang it. This blasted internet is interrupting my plat time. Hester, are you having some connection issues today? Nibon, between me and you, I don't I don't go anywhere ever at any time ever. <laughs> That's how I get around. I make the commute from my bed, which is behind me, to this desk. That's my big commute of the day. <laughs> yeah. But um when I'm when I am ready to rejoin the uh, the real world, um, yeah, trains. Trains. I use taxis as well, but I frequently use trains. I think if I'm going to London, it'd be train, then um, tube. Very same. I used I used it for like two hours every day before college and then COVID. Yeah, I mean, it's, yeah, it's a thing. Nibon, now we're thinking. Now we're thinking. Maybe, maybe if I get myself a bunk bed, I can just get a slide that puts me straight down into the chair as well. Gibbsy, me and you. I think some people, I mean, I'm not saying people don't get it in the community. I think a lot of you do. But in, in the world, some people get it and some people don't, Gibbsy. And I think you get it. And I think a lot of people here get it. But some people don't understand it. Um, but yeah, it is what it is. I'm still living a full and very happy life, but it's not quite the life I, I used to live. I was studying a PhD just when COVID became a thing. I was just about to get into teaching at my local university. I was teaching podcasting. Um, oh, don't you dare. Don't you, please, don't you dare. Um, and yeah, everything changed overnight. Look at this lot, having a little group meeting in the middle of the fucking crossing. 50 meters away, so that works great. Yeah, I've got an exercise bike here. I've got some weights here and I can get my groceries delivered. Um, I've got a network of people that can help me out. There's a, was there anything kind of special I needed, so yeah, we're uh, we're doing okay. Yeah, I think um, 
obviously not anytime soon, but if I was making some considerable bank from Twitch slash YouTube, yeah, I could make some very nice adjustments to my life, you know. Um, that's that's the long-term aim. But as for now, I'm just vibing. Just having a, a nice time with all my chronic friends. Oh, that was... No, 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 no. Nearly went up onto the pavement there. There we go. Got sent home from the US because of COVID. Really? Yeah. Is it this one or the next one? I think it's the next one. Public transport is non-existent, but deliveries mean that leaving the house is optional. Good call. Yeah, I'm very grateful for things like Amazon to deliver certain things. I know it's Amazon and Amazon gets very... They're not perfect, but um, I think sometimes when you're you know, chronic, when you've got health issues, sometimes you have to bite the bullet and say, I only can see the, the benefits really, unfortunately. Um, I'd love it if there was something else, maybe something more, uh, more bespoke, maybe something, you know, in the UK, something smaller, some organization that treated their uh, staff a bit better. But sometimes beggars can't be choosers. And I consider myself in some respects to be a beggar when it comes to the way I live my life. So you have to do what you have to do, you know, but it's made my life considerably easier. How did we do? How did we do? Four stars, okay. What did we get wrong? Oh, speed limit breaks. Interesting, okay. Oh, Nibon, I appreciate you. We did our very, very, very best. Little bit too fast, maybe for your liking. But other than that, I think we did pretty well. You got there alive. And we can't sell that for everybody in this game. I have to use the train every day. It's normally okay, but can get sketchy. Yeah, I think if I'd have wanted to keep doing my PhD, first I would have been living, surrounded by a bunch of people coughing all over me. But um, if I'd chosen to take myself away from campus, I would have had to take potentially a, a train and a taxi every day. I just wasn't prepared to do that. I've, I've worked hard to be alive. Um, and so that was my thinking back in 2020. Let's not throw it away now. Um, okay. Should we see if we could do a challenge run? Let me put the brake on first, the challenge run. Yeah, should we try? This looks like a challenge here. So this will either be go very fast or go very slow. I think that's the great thing about Twitch. The hermits can unite, you know? The introverts can gather together separately alone in their pajamas and uh, have somebody to talk to, which I love. Okay, big tip. Just don't, kill us. don't worry about the rules, she says, okay? Just get there quick, understood. Let's try not to crash though if we can. Oh, come on. Move, 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 move. We're in a rush. Right, it's pretty much a straight shot. 
hopefully we'll get a nice chunky tip. Ooh, break, 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 break. <laughs> oh, I thought I was gonna overshoot it for a second. How do we do breakwise? I mean, um, tipwise. Tip, 700 euro tip. <laughs> yes, very nice. And of course, all the coughing and stuff. Yes, yeah, the, the coughings. Oh boy, Gibbsy, I've got to be honest with you. Um, when I hear people cough in film or TV, I still find it quite triggering. I can't lie. How have I never seen Platt Brown? Would you like to know the story of Platt Brown, Ivan? Um, one day, Cumba said to me, um, I made you something. And I said, okay. And they said, now you might hate it. If you hate it, that's fine. And they showed me Platt Brown. And I was like, I fucking love it. So yeah, Cumber thought I'd think it was shit. And it's amazing. And uh, Platt Brown and Cumber Brown live side by side. Yeah. Yeah, it's amazing. That was a nice chunky tip. That was hard difficulty as well. That was a hard tip. It was a very hard tip. Oh, it was, oh wait a second. If you look over there, it's hard but short. Hard, short tip. All those, <laughs> all those words are there together. Not quite side by side. Hard, short tip. Right. How did we do? We drove against the traffic flow, but they said rules be damned. So that was pretty good. Hello, Darth. How are you, friend? Good to see you. How was Rise of the Ronin? I've got my copy right here, Darth. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. We're ready to go, everybody. If anybody wants to see Rise of the Ronin, it arrived today. We're ready to go. Oh, I'm the same. I watch a lot of classical performances. Always coughing in the crowd. I went to um, see the James Bond film. Was this 2021, maybe? Or 2020? Full packed cinema, mask on. Um, I, I just, I was like, I walked out there thinking, why did I do that to myself? Every little cough. And I'm just like, <laughs> it was horrible. And no one coughs more than an old person at a classical performance. Triggering, genuinely trigger. And the fact that they brought out um, so many pandemic related films and TV shows now with people cough. I'm just like, I will never watch these. Give me 20 years. Maybe I'll come back to them. But yeah, I just had my dinner. Darth, what was for dinner? What was for dinner? I need to know. It's good to see you. Darth, I don't know if you're interested, but next Friday, uh, we might be doing a bit of Suicide Squad, a bit of Team Suicide Squad, if you're interested. Um, the Joker uh, Season 1 is coming out for the Suicide Squad game. Loads of patches are coming out too, so hopefully the Platinum won't be blocked from me anymore. But um, yeah, Friday, if you're interested, we're, we're doing it. We're doing it. Me and Jerry are the two confirmed so far, but you'd be very welcome to jump in. Uh, yes, let us know what we have for dinner as well. Let me take a little look at... Oh, by the way, just a reminder. Um, we're at 850 YouTube lurk hours now. Once we get to 3,000, we can be a YouTube partner. So thank you to everybody that lurks. Also, I dropped a YouTube short there about an hour and 13 minutes ago. It was something that happened in this game yesterday. So any uh, likes or comments would be very much appreciated. Where it looks a bit unpolished, but otherwise seems cool. Hester, between me and you, between me and you and nobody else, Hester, this is just for me and you, okay? This is private. Everybody else put your fingers in your ears. I'm describing it internally and kind of externally. I've said it a few times on stream. I'm describing Rise of Ronin as a poor man's ghost of Tsushima. It doesn't look... as It doesn't look... I don't know how to finish that sentence. It doesn't look... But, um, yeah, we're going to give it a Before go. Before we begin, you must all be warned. Cheese, potato pie with beans. Nothing beans, here. star. Beans. It's vegetarian. We've converted Cumber Batchassi to uh, a beans on toast loving individual. We're a bit person by person. We're cracking the US. Cumber is a convert of beans on toast. So it's good to see some beans being represented in chat today. Yeah, I'm going to give um, Rise of Ronin the benefit of the doubt. But, like, Ghost of Tsushima is so good. And it really made an impact on me. And so, yeah, I hope this is good, but I'm I'm, being, I'm going into it skeptical, but I'm open-minded, I guess. Right, what are we doing? Are we picking another? I think we're picking another. Should we try and do another challenge? 
What's closer? I think this person's close. We'll pick you first and then we'll do another challenge. But yeah, Monday, Tuesday for certain, maybe Wednesday as well, if I'm liking it, we will be going back or we will be starting Rise of, Rise, Rise of the Ronin. I'm calling it Rise of Ron, by the way. I'm going to be, be referring, it to, referring to it as Rise of Ron next week, because why wouldn't I? And I might have to get some Ron Burgundy and Ron Swanson um, commands ready to go. We're going to call our protagonist Ron as well. Uh, Oath Sue, hello Oath Sue, good to see you. You've nailed the title, by the way. You're the second person to say that, Oath Sue. You are, welcome in. We're doing a bit more taxi sim today. How are you? How's your week been? Have you had any tasty food today, Oath Sue? What, in forever? Is that true, Darth? Like in, in any project ever? That's, a, that's amazing. I'm very surprised to hear that. I didn't even look at the title. How's the taxi life treating you? We're up to three taxis now. And apparently because of the recent um, patch, we can see them. Um, we can see the other taxis. We might bump into them, literally or figuratively. Mr. Burgundy, you have a massive erection. If people want to whisper me or if people want to suggest um, or send me messages in the Discord, about any Ron Swanson or any Ron Burgundy or any other Ron's uh, commands for next week, I'll be very happy to do it. Our protagonist will be called Ron. If you look at my schedule for next week, it's I put Rise of Ron, bracket I N, close bracket. So it's gonna be it's gonna be Ron next week. Uh, resume. Never returning. Do we know why this is? Because I think Bucky Sebastian Stan as Bucky is one of my favourite characters. I'm very surprised to hear that. Does that mean he's not going to be in the Thunderbolts? Very surprised to hear that. Perhaps the best run. There is a really good Ron Swanson quote, and I never remember what it is. But he says something like, I used to work with a guy. We never spoke to each other. Worked together for five years, never spoke to each other. Best friend I ever had, and I relate to that comment so much. I love that comment in my in my soul. Best friend I ever had. Yeah, I'm going to have to get that one for next week. I know more than you. <laughs> you might be in the new Captain America. I'm so sad to hear that, Darth. Yeah, it's been a day of sad news today. Kate Middleton has cancer. We learned today. Very sad. And Bucky's not returning to the to the role. A lot of people think he should be the new um he should be Luke Skywalker in any project involving Luke Skywalker because they look very similar. Um, which I, I, I believe. I think it's actually a very good likeness, but I'm sad to hear that. Maybe he's just done his time. Sad to hear that. Oath Sue, what have you been playing recently? I think it can be though, Darth. I think it can be. I think it's it's obviously not at a great moment, but I think it can be again. I think um, Deadpool three could be the uh, the moment it, it finds itself again. I'm, I'm trying to be an optimist, but I know what you're talking about. Uh, really, Crash. Hello, friend. Lovely to see you. We were on the mean streets of Barcelona today, Riddy. We've got one trophy already. And uh, we're just heading towards our next fair. If I, I'm crossing a few lanes here, hoping I don't get rear-ended. We're okay, we're okay. How has your day been, really? Uh, it's such a nice game to just watch and relax to. Yeah, and I've been telling people, it's a good one for a Friday. We used to do Power Wash Sim on a Friday. But um, yeah, I like to just give people a little easy ride into the weekend bit of lo-fi something relaxing and yeah just uh some people i know in america are still working so they can just relax to me as they 
get through the rest of the day, but just something to ease people into the weekend, I think is always a good shout. Monday, Tuesday. Really, I don't know if you can see this. Monday, Tuesday. Rise of the Ronin, but we are calling it Rise of Ron. Rise of Ron. And then we're going to have some Ron Burgundy and Ron Swanson uh, commands. Oh, we will be playing Crazy Taxi. Yeah, have you seen... I don't know if you've seen it. Really, have you seen the trailer for the Crazy Taxi reboot that's coming out next year, I think? Ron Rising, yeah. Yeah, it's going to be good. Uh, but yeah, I think there is a new Crazy Taxi on the horizon. So people like the taxi life. Maybe I'll give them some of the, uh, the Crazy Taxi life. Yeah, it looks fantastic. I did see the trailer for Alien Romulus. It looks, I think it looks really good. I love those films. I won't pretend I'm like a super fan or anything, but there's something about the xenomorph and the face huggers and the whole mythos around it, which I think is fantastic. Not a fan of Deadpool, but I'm excited for it. Yeah, Deadpool somewhere I did not know before the first Deadpool film came out. I had no knowledge, no knowledge at all. Right, Riddy, welcome to the taxi. Where are we taking you, Riddy? Where are we going? Is Riddy going to be a talkative one or a, or a silent one? Let's try and get Riddy where they're going in one piece. Green lights ahead. Looking good. Let's just break a little bit. Tappy, tappy, tappy. Swing around here. Hopefully there's nobody on the uh, zebra crossing. See if we can just pull around. Oh no, this guy's got the same idea as me. Let's just go see if we can go out here, go a little bit faster. Oh no, he's, he's zooming now. He's zooming. Uh, just a reminder, I put a YouTube short out about an hour and a half ago. It'd be really, really helpful for the algorithm if anybody could uh, like it, comment on it. It's from this game yesterday. And it's when that guy walked into my car and I got penalised for it. Oh, Riddy, you're a talkative one. Uh, I'm going to say yes. Here we go. No worries, really. We got you. It was an interesting conversation. Nice. Let's get ready. There we go. Green light. Oh, we nearly got rear-ended. We nearly got rear-ended. I did nothing wrong. I obeyed by the laws. That person nearly got me. I think I'm in the wrong lane, but we'll see if we can gingerly pull over here. Let's have a little pause. I like my Predator films more, uh, but this new Alien film looks pretty good. I like the Predator ones too. I went to see Alien vs. Predator at the cinema actually when it first came out. I'm... I'm cautious, Sam. I'm slightly cautious about it. I don't know. I've just Ghost of Tsushima is so good. I hope it lives up to that. I don't know that it will, but yeah, I'm, I'm cautiously optimistic. I think you can do four-player co-op, Sam. So I'm hoping we can get some people to jump in, and uh, we can all play Rise of Ron together. That's what we're calling it. Our, our protagonist is going to be called Ron for next week. Very chatty indeed. Yes. Clearly trying to scab you, yeah. It was like um, Slip and Jimmy from Better Call Saul. Does anybody know that reference? I can jump in, Darth. Perfect. Well, I'm gonna um, we're going to be playing it Monday, Tuesday for certain. But if I play it myself on Monday, maybe you guys can jump in on Tuesday. I want to obviously just see what it's about on Monday. 
But um, yeah, Darth, also, if you're interested in jumping in for Su uh, Suicide Squad on Friday, we're going to be doing some of that as well. <laughs> uh, it's going to be online with PvP. Really? I mean, that doesn't actually sound terrible. Um, I'd probably still give it a go. Yeah. I'll let you know. Okay, cool. Austin, thank you for the YouTube lurk, Austin. We're up to 850 YouTube lurk hours, Austin. I know you are there pretty much every day. Thank you so much for your hard work and dedication to the community. Once we reach 300, sorry, 3,000 watch hours on uh, YouTube, we can become a YouTube partner. So thank you to everybody that lurks over there. Austin, you're amazing. I think these are broken lights, so we'll go ahead. We're still taking Riddy where they need to go. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious. I'm curious. That might actually... They might try and turn it into something like Fall Guys. Obviously not exactly like Fall Guys, but some, some of the old online PvP stuff could be good. Could be the making of a franchise like that. You never know. Hopefully they've still got the uh, the single player stuff too, but we'll see. Yeah, does anybody know what I mean by Slipping Jimmy from Better Call Saul? The guy that walked into my da um, my bonnet last night, he knew what he was doing and I got fined $70, even though he walked into me. I need Missy to see that because she was uh, sad that she missed it. Right, really, we're nearly at your destination, really. We've not had any massive... Oh, I think I'm going too fast. I might get... I think I'm speeding here, so we might get mark points off for speeding. But uh, we're getting you to your destination in pretty decent time. Yeah, I bet we get one for saying not obeying traffic laws. Can anybody tell me any other runs? Any other good Rons that maybe I can get some more Ron commands for next week for Rise of Ron? Okay. Ron Weasley. Hello. Ron Weasley. Very good. Five stars. Speed limit breaks. What did I say? Ready? I said we get it for speed limit breaks. YouTube partner would be a great boon for you. Would you ever consider uh, reactivating affiliate? I've never activated affiliate. So, um... Yeah, one day, but not not yet. Uh, Ron, Ron McDonald, yes, these are good. These are good, really. I like where your head's at at the moment. Ron Burgundy, Ron Swanson, Ron Weasley, Ron McDonald. Um, yeah, this is good. Um, I think Mac from It's Only It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia is called Ronald as well. That's their first name. So maybe I'll get some Mac stuff too. The joke is that their name is Ronald McDonald. Um, oh, Robert Simpson. Okay. You're quite close to us. Perfect. Yeah, we'll take this. Ron Jeremy. Why not? Why not? Uh, actually, you're, you're close to us as the crow flies, but you're so far away from us in every other conceivable way. Um, I'm going to probably do some shenanigans to get to you a bit quicker. Because I'm not going the whole way round. Can, can we see this? He's here. I'm here. And I have to go like this. All the way around here. To get to here. So I don't think we're going to do that. Uh, yeah, we'll do some shenanigans. If we can we can uh, let me just quickly check the map yeah forward and left This is one way. Oh, bollocks. A second. I'm going to kill somebody in a minute. One of these is going to get killed. Yeah, they're not, they're not coming out, are they? They're letting me go. 
Okay, looks like we're going the long way around. I tried. I tried. They just stood there looking at me, blocking my, my route. Uh, while I do my McDonald's trip, I'll see you soon, matey. Enjoy, Sam. Enjoy. Try to breathe between mouthfuls. There's a lot of food there, okay? Lara Croft's nips. Hello, nips. Everybody, please, please be aware that Lara Croft's nips are here. The shift of your driver is finished. 755 profit. Yes. Our other driver made profit. Yes. Our company is functioning. Another person yesterday made a loss, which was very annoying. How are you doing, Nips? Good to see you. We are in the presence of Lara Croft's Nips, everybody. Please, please try not to stare. It's a special day for all of us. So can I go down here? Maybe this might save me some time. As long as nobody's driving towards me. Here we go. Saving a little bit of time. Ooh, a little bit of time. Let me just ride the pavement here for a second. We'll get there eventually. Doing good today. I'm really happy to hear that. That's fantastic. Fantastic. I'm, I'm very happy for you, Nips. I really am. Hello, Storm. Thank you for the YouTube lurk, Storm. We got we went past 850 hours, Storm. So thank you for contributing. We're getting there. We're getting there. The big 1000s on the horizon. So thank you for the uh, for being over there. How's your day going? Mine's going quite well. Um, we found out some sad news about Kate Middleton today, which uh, has yeah little rocked me a little bit. I can't lie. But I hope everything's good with your family. Lara Croft's nips. And to anybody else that wants to answer the question, what's the plan for the weekend? What are we doing for the weekend? Today, we are just relaxing with some lo-fi and some Barcelona driving. But what are you doing this weekend? You just got home? Good. Are you home for the week now? Is all the work done for the week? All right, let me reverse. A little bit too quick. I'm hanging, donating blood tomorrow, and a lot of streaming is my plan. As somebody, Storm, who has benefited from more bags of blood than I care to admit during my uh, travails, um, thank you for your, thank you for doing that. Somebody's gonna really benefit from that somewhere who is having a really bad day today, but um, your donation is gonna make that day a little bit better. Think I'm up to a couple of gallons. I believe it. <laughs> I believe it. I go very regular. Good. Good man. It, uh, yeah, helps in so many ways. So many kinds of people having so many, all kinds of problems. But yeah, I remember getting all kinds of, um, Bags of blood, black, um, blags, bags of blood, bags of platelets as well was another weird one. It was like a weird, it was like a bag full of jelly. It's very, very strange. Yeah. Very true. One thing about bags of blood was that, um, has anybody had a bag of saline attached to them? Like, like, um, like an IV of saline. Goes into the body quite quickly. Blood goes into the body so fucking slowly. <laughs> I remember getting a bag of blood and it took four hours. 
to go in. And I was thinking, oh, great, now I'm done. They were like, oh, sorry, did we not mention you need two bags? And the second bag, also four hours. It takes a fucking eternity to go in. I've done platelets, have you? Storm. Storm, you're a, you're a triple threat. Thank you so much. On behalf of the people who will receive those bags, thank you. Changing lives. Do you get given anything afterwards, like a cookie or like a sticker or, uh, or anything like that? Like a lollipop? Oh, slightly wonky here. She's always super sweet. That's nice. You need, I think for something like that, you've got to have a bit of empathy. You've got to know that um, it's obviously people are doing a nice thing, but it's not something anybody really wants to do. Stick a needle in their fucking arm, but you need people with a bit of patience, a bit of empathy. Um, it's good to hear they've got nice people there. All right, this is a long old journey. One of the longest journeys I think we've ever done. 2,000 meters away still. Let me just check if anybody else coming along. There isn't. So pull that into the middle. and getting started up, no worries. Do what you need to do. Thank you for stopping in. Some of these roads are quite narrow. They've got a little, this is a cycle lane on the left. I mean, I never see anybody on bikes, obviously, but uh, I feel like I'm not supposed to be in the cycle lane. So we've got this narrow little channel to go through. I wonder if any of the devs for this game have ever been watching. I'd love to talk to them. Flying car, first flying car of the day. Hey, there he goes. Nice. Uh, so funny. 
I wonder what causes that. I mean, I'm not a game dev, but like, I wonder why some cars are just up in the fucking sky. Ooh. Nearly bumped into him. Um... I know that we've driven in this part of the world before. It's very nice. We're normally kind of in the middle of town. I think we might have done quite well there. One, two, three, three. Okay, we've got five. Driving against the traffic flow. Driving in areas not available for cars. Okay, I think I, I don't remember doing either of those two. I've got to be honest. Missy, hello. Good to see you, Missy. We had a new Swedish person in here earlier. Yes, they were called Cell Pendragon. I don't know if they might be coming back later, but uh, they were here. Gibsy, Gibsy met them a bit earlier. Yeah, how has your day been? I know that you were sad that you missed the deaths yesterday. But if you go to YouTube, I made a YouTube short of one of them. And it's the most recent YouTube short if you'd like to see it. How has your day been otherwise, Missy? It's lovely to see you. Right, that wasn't too bad. Um, <clears throat> so we'll go and do go to the car wash. Um, currently in cuddle mode. Oh, thank you. I'm looking forward to seeing that later. Uh, yeah, let's go to the car wash. Lip reading kind of looks like he's saying Missy. I I am. Do you mean me? Are you lip reading me? I am saying Missy. Yes. Uh, okay, let's try not to get hit by a car. Oh, the emotes. Oh, I see. Sorry, on restream, I don't see, um, I can't see animated emotes. I only see them in still. Yeah, it's one of the, it's one of the downsides of restream, but uh, it's, otherwise it's pretty good. I'm so tired today. I went to a grown up rehab for my autism and I'm tired as hell. Missy, that sounds like a very positive thing to do. How was it? How did you find it? Um, but yeah, don't worry. Just, you know, yesterday, um, you said you fell asleep to the um, stream a few times. Fell asleep maybe to the music. Fell asleep to just the driving. Feel free to have a little sleep now. 
Just ignore how round I look. <laughs> I'm excited to see it. I bet you look great. Yeah, Missy, have a little sleep. Just, uh, we'll all be here with you. Body double with us. And just relax. Is this the way? This is the way. Doesn't look right, but up we go. But yeah, I hope you enjoy the um, video on YouTube. That's that's my first death of yesterday. Which isn't fair because I didn't move. I was parked. The guy walked into me. Oh, have I gone the wrong way? No, why is the game telling me I've gone the wrong way? I don't think I've gone the wrong way. That was some BS, it really was. We were parked and he walked into my bonnet and that was the first day. Missy was very sad to miss it, but um, you didn't really miss out on much. It was, yeah. That guy was just looking for a payday, that's what it was. It went well, I guess. I don't really know, but we talked about my issues, so to speak. Now I'm gonna get more appointments in the future. Might as well try it. Missy, that sounds fantastic. I'm very proud of you. That sounds like a really positive step you've made today. Um, and if there's anything we can do to help, we'll all be here, we will all support you. Yeah, sounds fantastic. Fantastic, well done. Okay, I think it's, qu it, yeah, it's 8 p.m. So I think I'll go to one of these places and sleep for the night. Let's go sleep. Um, how do I? How do I get out of here? The game's not being super helpful because it's just showing a blue square. Is that the way out? I think this might be the way out, yeah. <laughs> okay. Probably for the best. Wait a second. Have I still got this marked? Yeah. Okay. We're going the right way. That's good. I think I need to put on my... my low lights Someone. 
Right, I think our bed for the night is up ahead. Please do, Gibbsy. Yeah, please do. There we go. Right, let's have a little sleeping. <sighs> but if we have the spoons for it, just giving it a try is great. Yes. I'm sorry for the delayed reaction. Yes, we had somebody called Cell Pendragon. Gibbsy got to meet them. And um, I'm not sure if they're still here. They might come back later, potentially. But yes, they, they dropped in and I told them about you. I told them about Gibbsy. I told them about Tagira as well. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Giving Missy extra spoons. Nice. Yeah, the two of you can hold each other accountable. You can push each other on to keep attending all of your appointments, which I think is a really good thing to do. Uh, resting. Let's uh, rest all the way through till 8 a.m., I think. The non-assigned the drivers got their salaries. What? How have I not have I got a non-assigned driver? Maybe it means assigned drivers got their salaries. Yeah. Oh, these might be new people I can hire. Uh, the employee gets more profit for driving better cars. The employee provides less money per day. The employee gets more profit for driving better uh, cars. This guy gets, his car gets dirtier quicker. The employee gets more profit for driving better cars each, uh, this person seems pretty good, actually. Yeah, their fee is a bit higher, but I think they might make more money for driving better cars. What does better car mean? What does that actually mean? These are both sickly, these two. Oh, I can't pick 8 a.m. for you. That's very annoying. It's in increments of three. We'll go with 9 a.m. Okay, right, they're both set. Swedish, uh, Swedish word of the day. Glid medal, meaning a lubricant. The funny direct translation is sliding aid. That is brilliant. Gibbsy, that is perfect. Is it glid medal? Glid metal, like a glide. Glid metal. Sliding aid, that is so perfect. Thank you, Gibbsy. You've nailed it. You've nailed the brief. Gibbs always keeping the words on brand, indeed. It's Friday, Hester. It's Friday. It's just when you've been going to different appointments for different problems mentally, you just start to lose hope and faith that it's going to do anything, really. And I have to trust issues. And I have trust issues, so not a great mix. I think the fact that you're trying, Missy, at the end of the day, 
I think the only thing somebody can really do is make you feel comfortable. And hopefully these, these people make you feel comfortable. But um, I think sometimes there's a benefit from just being honest with people. So if you can sit there with this, this new, new person in your life, if you feel comfortable, if you can be honest with them, um, yeah, I think it can only be good. But yeah, I'm glad you're being open-minded. I'm glad you're giving it a go. But um, yeah, we all support you. And um, just don't, don't put too much pressure on yourself, you know? Let it happen. Let it happen organically. Don't try and force, you know, confessions out or talk about what you think you should be talking about. Just, just take it. Just be relaxed about it, I think. Don't put any pressure on yourself. Uh, yeah. Okay, I think that we've just got basically an upgrade with this driver, I think. I think we've got a better driver now. Right, uh, how do I leave? How do I leave? Uh, so we've got 3,300. We're already on the, on, well on the way to getting another car. Um, I need to turn my car on. That'd be a good start. Get the brake off. That'd be a good start too. Let's hope I don't get hit by a car. That'd be wonderful. Oh, there's somebody right there. There's a passenger right there. Hester, is this you? I think this is Hess that we're picking up. Oh, hold on a second. No, this must be this must be Gibbsy. Because it's an Albert Einstein looking individual. Gibbsy, this is you. The Albert Einstein twins are Gibbsy and Missy. Pedestrians having a bit of trouble over there. Oh, now they've turned back and they're going the other way. Of course they are. Oh, and are they turning back again? What are they doing? They do not have a fucking clue what they're doing. Right, let's go. Another beautiful day in Barcelona. You what, mate? You nearly were our, uh, our passenger. But it's Gibbsy instead. Because it looks like Albert Einstein. So that means it's Gibbsy or Missy. Oh, I think we've just gone above the speed limits there, so that's a shame. I tried to correct it as quickly as I could, but we might get points off for that. Looking good. Oh, nearly went into the wrong lane. I love how they do a little moonwalk when they turn around, yeah. I can talk about my issues uh, since I've done it so often over the years. It's gotten easier to say it. Doesn't mean it doesn't hurt, but it's just meh. The problem is I don't know if they can help me. As others before, has been pure shit. So I'm just skeptical all the time. Well, I mean, you've got us as well. You know, we're not professionals, but we will always help you in any way we can. And we'll always talk to you. If you need, if you feel like you want to maybe talk to us about issues as well, you're more than welcome to. Glad I have you here, Gibbs. Yeah, I'm glad you're both here.
Sometimes it's, you can just feel unburdened by talking. You don't necessarily need them to give you answers or anything. You know, sometimes just you can feel, yeah, like I said, you can feel unburdened. Oh, what the fuck is this? What are you doing? I'm going to get marked down for this because they drove into me. They drove into me. Missy. Unbelievable. Well, at least I'm trying indeed. That's all you can do, Missy. And you're being, I'm very proud of you. You're making positive steps. Trying to help your life, you know. Very proud of you. How you doing, Preston? Good to see you. It's going okay. Still quite cold down here, but uh, not too bad. We just got rammed into by some, some prick in a car. How's life going? What have you been up to? Oh, don't you hit me again. Don't you hit me again, bitch. Does it results take time for 100%? It's always very difficult to invest into something that you can't be sure is working. But of course, it's always worth working to improve your life, yeah. And I think that's the important thing is starting, you know? It's so like we've got the um, we've got the exercise accountability channel as well in the Discord. Once you start something, it becomes easier. But starting, it can be the most difficult thing. So yeah, the fact that you're making these steps, Missy, very very proud of you. Blaming the victim. What a realistic game. The lucky streak of the community helped me. So you got the job. What job did you get? Very exciting. Yeah, Elliot got a job. Who else got a job? Elliot got a, got a new job. Who was the other one? I can't remember who it was, but yeah, the um, the community's job, um, like being hired, luck continues. You're not sinking, Missy. I won't allow you to sink. This community will be your uh, life jacket, you know. Lights are green. Why are they still crossing? It says red. It says people shouldn't be walking at this point. Oh, my God. I thought the lights were going to turn red for me. I thought I wasn't going to have the time to cross. some volunteer work to get me back into the swing working. Perfect. One hundred percent. It's a good step in the right direction. 
like you said, it'll get you back in the swing of things. Give you that that muscle um, muscle memory. It'll awaken the muscle memory of how to uh, be an employee, you know. Can I open the windows? Great question. How do I open the windows? Which windows? He said, if I ever see Christ again, he's a dead man. <laughs> How do I? Okay. It's the, I think we did it. <laughs> Apparently. They weren't turning orange, so I didn't, I wasn't sure I was doing it. Missy, I think it's really important um, for you to know what you want to get out of it as well. What, it, you, you don't have to tell us, but um, if you're turning up to these places hoping that they'll just give you what you need, but if you don't know what you need, then you're probably going to be let down. You're probably going to walk away disappointed. So it might be good for you to have an idea in your mind what you want to achieve from these sessions. I think that's really, really important. Maybe tell the person next time you see them what you want to achieve from the sessions. And then that will give you a better sense of whether they're working or not. But yeah, if you're just going there and they're just asking questions and making kind of like general kind of random suggestions and none of it's particularly helpful, then um, I can understand why you might feel a bit mad about it. But yeah, try and give yourself some actual parameters. Yeah, try and give yourself some actual pr parameters of what you want from the sessions. And then you never know, you might be surprised and you might actually get what you want. And then you might get a lot of positivity from that, you know. Gibbs is very good with the sound alerts. I'm going to get a few more for next week for uh, Rise of Ron. Was Gibbsy? How did we do, Gibbsy? Four stars, not terrible. 500 euro. Not stopping at red lights, driving against the traffic flow. But we got you there safely, Gibbsy. We got you there on time and safe. I'm loving the music tonight. Good job. Happy to hear that. Small tip. It's all right. It's all right, Gibbsy. Maybe it was cold. Maybe you just got out of the swimming pool, you know? Do a challenge. Let's do a challenge run. So if I got to go this way and turn around, let's try and do this without being spanked.
It's not heavy missing. It makes me happy to hear in some ways because it makes me know that you feel comfortable talking to us. But um, just know that we're just, I'm so glad to know you and we all are. Um, if you feel, when you think about yourself, if it feels like you're floating, just know that we, we have more kind of concrete feelings towards you and we appreciate you. Um, <laughs> just, just know that. But I think it could be really beneficial, Miss. I won't, you know, give you homework for the week or anything. But for you to really think about what, what these sessions could do to benefit your life, how they could help you. I know it's going to be tough, but if you can identify a way that your sessions with this person, if you could identify what you want from them, it might help not just help you, but it might help them as well because they can tailor the conversations towards what you need them to be. You're not going to know today. You're not going to know in an hour. You might, you might not even know in a week. But if you just give it a little bit of thought, um, it could be, it could just make them a better experience. You know, then you won't be maybe, you might feel like you're not wasting the sessions um, as much. Um, yeah, I want these sessions to work for you. That's the thing. It probably took you a while to get them. It might have taken you a while to like get it all booked or... You might have been on a waiting list. So now that you have them, you've got to use them as best as you can. Because um, you don't want to have any regrets, you know. I'm sorry if that was a bit heavy. You apologize for being heavy. I'm sorry if that was a bit heavy. But I just want I want the best for you, Missy. That's all I can say. I don't feel well. Oh, carefully. This one's a careful one, okay. Right, no traffic violations, everybody. Best behavior. This is a 30, uh, 30 area. I'm gonna, I'm gonna indicate for everything. Even if I don't need to, I'm gonna indicate for everything. Okay. 30, oh shit, I'm at 29. Oh God, that was close. I nearly broke the uh, speed limit. I'm not sure what the speed limit is here. Oh, it's pretty, it seems to be faster than I'm going. Unless that person's breaking the law. we do I don't think we broke any laws are you about to cross over I'm gonna be very careful here no I don't think they are okay good good to see how do we do show me that big tip five stars Ooh, 800 tip Oh, not stopping at red lights. Fuck, I don't remember doing that. It's been years so far with multiple appointments, meeting countless people supposed to help. But I guess I'll try again, but only because you asked. Missy, can I just, um, I thought you said show me that big tip. I mean, if anybody wants to show me a big tip, I mean, you know, lay it on me. Uh, but I did say tip. Missy, think, think this might just be something for you to think about over the weekend. With those people, did you know what you wanted from those sec uh, sessions? Did you talk about what you wanted from those sessions? Sam, put it away. Nobody wants to see that. Put it away, Sam. <laughs> but yeah, Missy, it, it might be because you've never known what you wanted from the sessions. That, that, that meant they didn't work for you. If this time it could be different, if you can figure out what you want from these sessions, maybe, maybe they'll help you maybe the sessions will work better. 
if you have some parameters about how you want them to help you. Does that make sense? We can maybe talk about this in Discord a bit in a bit more detail. But um, yeah. Why is it that I come in here and you're asking for big tits being laid? <laughs> I mean, Indy, if you've come to offer. Um, but yes, somebody, I said, show me that big tip. I mean, that's bad enough. But we were talking about the person giving me a tip because they said if I got them there safely and carefully, they'd give me a big tip. But Abby heard big tits. So big tips, big tits. Hey, anything goes here. It's 18 plus. So uh, yeah, well, anything goes. We're all about the big tits in this community, apparently. Well, I mean, considering your name is Lara Croft's Nips, you're... <laughs> yeah, it's, you're very on brand, Nips. Very on brand today. I wanted to get better. I wanted help. I just got disappointment. Do you know what, Missy? I think it'd be... Should we have this conversation in Discord? Because I want to give you the time you deserve. I don't want to give you bad advice. But yeah, if you can think about, you said you, you wanted to get better, you wanted to get help, but, but yeah, maybe there's a way that these people that you talk to can help you. And we haven't figured that out yet. Um, maybe you haven't figured out exactly what these people can do for you. So it might just take a second of thought, maybe really sit down at the weekend, and just think, how could this, um, these conversations you're having with this professional, how could they benefit you? Um, and if you can think of an answer, I assure you they cannot, maybe they can't, but if you can think of an answer, maybe that might help the person tailor the conversations particularly to you. I don't know. That's just a thought that I'm having, but, um, yeah, maybe just something to think about. I don't know. Indy, how are you doing? How was your day going? Um, a certain package might be in uh, NYC, Indy. You might have reached NYC. Not me avoiding my laundry. <laughs> if you're not following Indy, you're a damned fool. I do um, the L word on Sundays. Like the TV show, the L word. They're lovely. <laughs> laundry. Not. You can also watch the L word. I should rewatch the L word. What a terrible show. It's a good show. It's a terrible show, though. <laughs> what laundry. a good show. It's a terrible show. But what a good show, though. Uh, my day's not bad. Did a big food shop. Making some... Uh, some of that brilliant yeah sounds delicious um if i wasn't following before i am now i've met so many weirdos let's give let's give india another shout out Wednesday stream. oh hello i remember that hair i remember that hair very well Give me, let me, let me do this next room, Miss, and then I'll love you. <laughs> yeah, make sure to follow Indy. Likes to play Hades. Likes to play cute games like Unpacking or a little to the left. Um, yeah, a great time. One of my, honestly, I said, said this before, I'll say it again. One of my favorite places to be on Twitch. That's why they're in my, um, what do you call it? My, if you look in the home section, my like designated streamers or my recommended streamers or something. Yeah. It's a spicy simmered rice cake is a popular Korean food. God damn it. Everybody's having Korean food right now. And I need to try some, whether it's Korean barbecue, whether it's this thing that I'm not going to try and pronounce. Tech Boki. I don't know. But um, yeah, I need to try me some Korean food. I appreciate you in me. Uh, yeah, hopefully that package arrives. Hopefully my package arrives at your house within the next five days. Um, okay, if I missed anything in chat, please don't hesitate. But I think I think we that was good. So excited for the package. I hope you enjoy my package, Indy. I think you will. McDonald's has been consumed. Sam, take a breath. There was a lot of food there. You told us it was a big old, big old order. So take a minute. Take a breath. Um, right. That was a, so this was a challenge run. We had to do, um, we had to get this person from A to B without breaking any laws. We did quite well. We got five stars. They tipped me. This was the big tip, Indy. The very big tip. 
uh, of 800 euros. So we're saving up for our fourth taxi, I think. We've got a fleet of three now, including the one we drive. So yeah, we're uh, our little little taxi company is going from strength to strength. Mm-hmm. Big tip. Got it. Yes. Big tip. Uh, Do you want to tell okay. it to my sister, Ruth? Okay. This Thank one you. This is for Stacey. Hello. And if you could hand this one to my boyfriend. Fuck you. Whiskey! If I do a good job, I receive a tip. So yeah, Indy, may I may I offer you a ride, Indy? Let's give Indy a ride, shall we? Run away to pick up Indy. Welcome to Friday chat. It's it's like this most of the time, let's be honest. They say your community resembles you. Yeah. Uh, Missy, so do I. It's not really a thing in the UK. Um, it's, it's a thing in the UK, but it's a very different thing in the UK. It's not something expected. It's something this is at least my understanding it's something given for exceptional service in any it can be in like um i think tipping in america is like any any kind of you know realm but i think it's only you'd only really think about it in restaurants in the uk because i i can't I, i've never worked in restaurants but i think the wages are better nobody's saying they're perfect but um yeah it's not something where you're supplementing the wage of the server in the UK, it's very much, if, if somebody goes above and beyond, you'd give them a tip. Um, but if, if the service was bad, they would expect to receive no tip. Whereas I believe in America, even when the service is bad, people will still be expected to tip. I might be completely wrong about that, but I find the tipping, um, tipping culture fascinating. I ate that food way too quickly. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Frantically scrambling for some gavis. God, Jesus, Sam. I mean, there was so much food there as well. God damn it. I'm surprised you didn't just put in a fucking blender and drink the thing down. It's, that's how quickly you consumed it. Big fan of Friday Night Chat. Friday Night Dinner spin-off. Yeah, we're going to have a big tipping, as in tipping culture conversation another time. Because I don't want to say things that are wrong. Because I've only, you know, people have told me bits and pieces about American tipping, but... I saw a TV show once where somebody went, um, they arrived in America. They tipped the cabbie. They then got to the hotel. They tipped the person that they got their tickets from. They tipped the porter and then they tipped somebody else. And then the joke was that they had no money left because they tipped every single person that they'd, every single person had expected a tip on the way to the, the hotel. And that just does not happen in other cultures. I, it could be to do with comparative wage. I don't know. But um, yeah, it's just, yeah, I find it fascinating. I'd love to learn actually, I'd love to actually know instead of just making up, you know, potentially guessing about these things, but yeah, it's fascinating. I'm currently, currently shoving a Southern fried chicken fillet in my gob. It sounds like a good Friday night to me. I find tipping culture sad, just pay them for their work, goddamn, yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, we got pedestrians causing trouble again. Go, drive before the lights turn red. Go. Right, let's see if we can pick up Indy without any more incidents. I like that they call them clients in this. I think the lights here are broken. That's why they're flicking. I don't want to get rammed by you. Right, where's Indy? 
Where is Indy? I'm fighting demons right now. Got to wait for Gav to kick in. Sam, this is a learning moment, Sam. This is a teachable moment, as they call them. Going down here? Okay, I think Indy's down here. Let's go. Uh, thank you so much for the follow. I think I recognize that name. I think I recognize that name. How are you today? We do anonymous follows. So uh, I won't say anything unless you say something, but you're very welcome just to lurk. I hope you're well. Oh my goodness, look, it's Indy. It's Indy. We just picked up Indy, I can't believe this. Uh, right, we've got to go. I'm try gonna try not to get Indy killed if I can. I'll do my best. Right, let's go. Uh, they always cause trouble. I'd be more surprised if one of them suddenly grew a <laughs> Oh God. <laughs> True, hello new person, welcome to the lounge. This person, I think, well, if you were here for the raid yesterday, I think it's the person we raided into. Um, but yes, we'll still do the anonymous follower thing in case they want to ha keep some anonymity. But yeah, lovely to see them. Right, let's get Indy where they need to go. Hopefully in one piece. We've met some very lovely people, I will say, with our... Uh, our raids we've been doing. I passed out. I know you did, Missy. Do you know what, Missy? It makes me happy. It really does. When Abby sleeps, when you sleep, when uh, Lady Vlava sleeps during the streams, I know you will work very hard. If I can help you get those Zs, happy to do it. Lude Chells. Hello, Chells. Welcome in. We've been talking a lot about big tips today, Chells. In my taxi, I'm trying to get all the big tips. How is everything with you, Charles? Before we continue with Indy's journey, let's give you a little shout out. How's everything? Have I got a surprise for you? I am in the between of wanting and not wanting to stream. All right, Charles, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Why would you not want to stream? Are you feeling tired today? Are you in pain today? Because I'll tell you what I tell everybody. If you're not going to enjoy it, other people aren't going to enjoy it. If you're not going to enjoy it, other people aren't going to enjoy it. And there are plenty more times for you to stream. you got all the, all the days, every day for the rest of your life to stream. If you're not feeling it today, don't worry about it. If you stream tomorrow, I'm in an off mood. I mean, it's always up to you. I'm not going to force you one way or the other, but like I said, if you're in an off mood and you're not on your best, other people might, you know, they might not enjoy themselves there tonight. Uh, no, it's not, Missy. No, we've known Chels since about August time. Chels is a, is a long time friend of the channel. But yeah, it's up to you, Chels. But um, if you want to stay with us for a bit, why don't, you do, why don't you do this? Stay with us for a bit. Listen to the lo-fi. Um, watch me drive around Barcelona. It's very beautiful. Chat with the chat. Um, and you might feel a bit better. We might be able to help that mood. We might be able to turn that frown upside down. And then you might feel like streaming. But it, like I said, just there's no pressure. The real ones will be there whenever you stream. They'll always be there for you. Uh, right, let's go. Oh, I've got my break on. Right, Indy, we've nearly got you to your destination. Here we go. How did we do? How did we do? Can you tell I'm out of it? Miss your perfect however you are. 
Don't be too hard on yourself. You're doing great. Safe and sound, Preston. Let me see how we did. We got a little, we got a little tip. Indy gave us a little tip. Not too bad. Not too bad. My brain. Is... <laughs> Missy, in this community, I think most of us, most of our brains are mush every day. So I wouldn't worry about it, really. That's why it's good that we found each other. We're a, we're a group of chronics and we don't need to explain it. We don't need to tell people. We just know. We just know how it is. Uh, right. Should we try and find another challenge? Not too bad. We got Indy there safe and sound. Five star review. Pretty happy. I'm going to skip this song. It's a bit too loud for my liking. I might even remove it from the playlist. It's a little bit too, a little bit too loud. It's zigging and I'm, I'm zagging. It's not the size, it's what you do with it. I'll make sure to tell Indy a bit later. Right. Again, remind me everybody, hoping the music's a good volume for everybody. Um, let me know. Uh, okay, yeah, what we're looking for Dick is another challenge, sneaky when he's going in through the back door. Indeed. Indeedy. Right, let me go here. This is a challenge, I think. Or... No, we'll do this. I think exclamation mark follow age should work. I think it. No, it. No, it I think it's something I've I've got on this channel. There you go, Preston. One year, five months, fourteen days. Very nice. Very nice. Seven months, 24 days, 22 hours. And I remember exactly when we met, Charles. I remember exactly when we met. Right, let's see if we can get over to this challenge without being killed. It was a time I was so awkward. You were perfect, Charles. You were perfect. Uh, thank you very much for the follow. We do anonymous follows. Uh, you're very welcome here. Um, feel free to lurk, feel free to say hello. Either way, welcome in. When I played the forest, yes, 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 I remember. Hey, welcome in. Very nice to meet you. How are you doing today, Gaming Queen? I hope you're well. Um, we're, we're doing pretty well. We're playing a game today called, uh, what's it called? Taxi Life, a city driving simulator. Bit of a mouthful, but uh, we're having a good time with it. Tell me something about you. Uh, where are you from? What kind of games you like to play? Let's get to know each other. Uh, Gibbsy, very nice. Been lurking a little. This looks good to be fair. So if you've got any questions, Gaming Queen, one of the big things I like to do with um, fairly new releases, and we played this uh, most of the week of release, but we really liked it, so we've stuck with it. But um, yeah, if you've got any questions, feel free to uh, answer. I'm from Essex. I'm from Kent. Gaming Queen. I'm from Kent. Uh, Forward to this year. Eek. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. They say 40 is the new 30. And 30 is the new 20. And 20 is the new 10. And 10 is the new you've just been born. My in-laws are in Kent. Perfect, yeah. I mean, yeah, we're, we're pretty close. Close, you and I. Um, Sam Jenko, I think, is from... Sam, are you here? I think Sam's from Essex. Is that right, Sam? I don't know if Jenko's here. He was here a second ago. I think he might be from Essex as well. But yeah, we're acquiring... In the beginning, it was all US people. Everybody joined us from the US. In the past six months, it's been all UK people and all Central European people. We've had a whole influx of uh, UK people uh, over the past three weeks, mostly since I've been playing this game. I don't know what it is about driving that brings the UK crew in <laughs> to watch, but um, it's, yeah, it's wild. Which is so good. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, um, yeah, we're all having a good time. Missy, uh, 
two months, 19 days, 18 hours. Yeah. And I think, Missy, about six weeks of that, you weren't here. We were looking for you for about six weeks of that as well. But yeah, we're glad we found you again. Longer than I thought. Interesting. Time flies when you're having fun, Missy. That's what it is. But yeah, seriously, uh, Gaming Queen, any questions? People tell me, um, like I said, when new games come out, I like to do like a Let's Play slash review. So we're going to be doing uh, Rise of the Ronin next week as well as like a Let's Play review. But when I did the review of this, I, I pretty much, I, I really liked it. It had a few problems and thankfully one of those problems has been completely patched out now. So yeah, if you have any questions, let me, I'm like a used car salesman. Let me get you in, let me get you in a new car. Let me get you in this car. Let me sell you this game. What kind of games do you like to play? Supermarket Sim, been non-stop. I'm like that with Power Wash Sim. Yeah, we, um, so this community, um, Gaming Queen, we're full of people that have chronic illness, chronic fatigue, chronic pain, uh, chronic illness, like I said, mental health issues. So when it comes to um, the streams, occasionally we like to do a chilled game with some lo-fi. So as you can hear right now, we've got the lo-fi playing. But um, yeah, Power Wash Sim, that's our big, you know, bring the temperature down, relax kind of game. But this is kind of taking its place at the moment. So we we do have a space for Sim games, but yeah, mostly like a AAA kind of gamer, mostly. But yeah, we, we, like, we like to just bring the temperature down occasionally. Uh, anything lewd is basically Gibbs bait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love House Flipper. Almost earned all the achievements. Nice. We're not. We're doing pretty well actually with um, Power Wash Sim. So yeah, my thing is Platinum Trophies, Gaming Queen. Just in case you didn't, uh, in case you didn't get that part. Um, but yeah, this one's not so much about the trophies. We're just having a nice, relaxing time with it. But yeah, next week will be a Rise of the Ronin. We're calling it Rise of Ron, um, and we're gonna have lots of Ron-related commands like Ron Burgundy. Um, Ron Swanson, Ron Weasley. Um, but yeah, we're calling it Rise of Ron. Might make our own little narrative with it. Um, but yeah, I appreciate the lurk. Appreciate being in here. Stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. 6 p.m. GMT. Don't have to translate that for you. And yeah. I'm giving uh, people in the community, giving them rides around Barcelona. We just um, gave a lift to our good friend Indy Glow Stick. So I think we're going to do a challenge next, actually. It's either going to be go really fast or go really slow. So we'll see what it is. Oh, we're trying our best not to kill pedestrians as well. Even though, as Missy will tell you, they don't really have that many brain cells uh, between them. They'll cross the crossing, they'll turn around and they'll immediately walk back across. They'll bump into each other in the middle of a crossing. Ron Perlman, yes, we didn't think about Ron Perlman. I'm gonna have to write these down, Nips. I'm gonna have to write these down. I'm gonna have loads of commands, I think. Knowing Gibbs, yeah, I'm gonna have to put a pretty um, strong cooldown on them. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna have all the runs for Rise of Ron. Yeah, it's here ready to go, but um, we wanted to do some taxis today. So, yeah. Oh, my Lord, Ron Perlman. Uh, they basically share the same one they do. Yeah, so this is next week, Rise of Ron. About about commands, Pat. Thank you, Gibbsy. Thank you. You can be the, uh, the scribe or stenographer. If people are uh, suggesting Rons, you can whisper all the Rons to me. Had to butt in when I heard his name. Ron Perlman's great. We'll have to have some Hellboy related stuff. Uh, me, right. What does this person need? Quick or slow? Slow. Gentle. They want me to be gentle with them. Right, so they said be gentle and I can receive a big tip. That's what they like. We don't kink shame here. We'll do our best. That's what they want. Who do I have to bend over a bar and indiscreetly fuck to get some coffee around here? Yeah. 
Many volunteers. <laughs> Did I ever tell you guys the irony is I don't drink coffee? That was a that was a line from uh, Evil West that people li liked so much that I said it, I repeated it, and they wanted me to turn it into a sound command. But yeah, I do not drink coffee. Oh, we rode the fucking curb. That's going to be a pe that's going to be a penalty. It's going to be a penalty. I can tell. Damn it. We can still get a big tip though. We can still get a big tip if we're gentle. Oh, it's one of the um, the other taxis. It's one of our rivals, everybody. Shall I round them off the road? I've never seen Sons of Anarchy. Don't get me started. My room is plastered with it. I'm meeting Katie. Katie Sagel? I'm so sorry. I've no clue. Oh my God, why? You lucky devil. Hope you have a blast. Excuse me. Um, Preston, where are you meeting this person? Because uh, I think Nips, you're in the UK. Preston, Preston's in the UK as well. I don't know if they're coming to the UK. Comic-Con in my town. Hopefully going to uh, get myself a nice, fantastic. Hope it goes well for you. Yeah. I went to a London Comic-Con not too long ago. This was just as COVID was becoming a thing. And Nolan North was there and uh, Troy Baker were there. But um, I've got to be honest, I went there and I'm, I'm a high risk individual. So I, I felt very uncomfortable. I stayed there for a while. We, we schmoozed. We promoted our podcast, but I couldn't, I couldn't stay for the Nolan North stuff. So I noped out. Hopefully I get to meet them one day. But um, yeah, I think they were promoting like Uncharted 4 or something, even though it was a bit late on. I, I assume they played somebody in Sons of Anarchy. Yeah, but I've never heard of them, unfortunately. A lot of the actors are going to be there. Really, Preston. Nice. Very nice. The only Lord of the Rings related thing we have here is um, exclamation mark. Sorry. Do, do, do. Okay. Easy does it. Easy does it. Been doing pretty well so far. This is a slow journey, isn't it? Yeah. This person's not feeling well, so we've got to be careful. Oh, we rode the curb again. I'm not sure what the speed limit is here. I'm just trying to be as gen gentle as I can. <clears throat> Are we going to get that big tip? Let's see. Oh, I rode the curb again. All right, let's see how we did. Okay. Five stars. Five stars. It was hard and it was short. We got a thousand euro tip. Small collisions. I think these were the uh, riding the curbs. Driving against the traffic flow. I don't remember doing that. I don't remember doing that. Uh, she was also in Married with Children and played Penny. Do you, do you mean Leela? Is this Leela from Futurama? Is that the same person? Yes, I know Leela from Futurama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I know who you're talking about now. Yeah, she's awesome. She's awesome. I didn't know she was in Sons of Anarchy. I saw Lord of the Rings the most... I saw Lord of the Rings. The most memorable thing for me was Gollum. He looked like a drugged up Voldemort. In the Green Street movie. Oh, nice. That's very cool. Yeah, I remember the Green Street movie. 
What? No one I know has even watched it. She was in Futurama. Yeah, yeah, Leela. Yeah. I'm glad you made a you've made another connection, Nips. Nips and, and Missy were talking about their horror, their love of horror films. And now where Nips and Preston uh, realised they like Sons of Anarchy. That's fantastic. Right, that was a good chunk of money, actually. We're on the way to getting our next taxi. Oh, Lord, I'd die if I met him. <laughs> right, well, let's go. Let's try another uh, challenge, actually. Let me put the brake on first. Any challenges around here? What about you? What about you? You're closer. Let's do you. Well, let's do this challenge. Dramatic. I respect it, Preston. Do you know what, Preston? Unfortunately, I can't tell anybody any of the details about it, but I was in a Twitch chat last night and I met one of my absolute YouTube icons. And I was very, very starstruck. I couldn't believe it. I didn't say anything to them. I wanted to, but um, I thought, you know what? Just play it cool. Just play it cool. Yeah, so I, I think I, I felt a similar kind of vibe last night. Shedding a tear or two when I meet Katie. Nice. Nice. I've met quite a few celebrities as well. The problem is I'm older than most people here. And so I don't know that you guys necessarily know the celebrities that I've met. But I met, um, I went to, well, I went to um, Bob Geldof's birthday party once. And Sting was there. And Mick Jagger was there. And Jerry Hall was there. And John Hurt was there. I also met Richard E. Grant once when um, I went to I went to university with his daughter. Um, who else have I met? I met Jules Holland once as well. Um, who else have I met? I met when I was very, 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 very young. I met uh, David Jason as well because I lived in the village they were filming a TV show in. Um, I've met other people too, I'm trying to think. Oh, um, if any football fans, UK football fans, Roberto Mancini was the manager of Manchester City at the time. Um, yeah, Roberto Mancini, I was on the Tube in London and uh, he was there. Nobody was paying any attention to him. I think he was, he was trying to keep, you know, low, low key. And I didn't want to make a big weird fuss by screaming his name. So I walked over to him. I made eye contact with him and I reached out my hand and he shook my hand. And we were in um, Chelsea at the time, and I thought maybe he's going to meet Chelsea because he's going to be their new manager or something. Uh, but that was really cool. But nobody will know Roberto Mancini. I was in the same room as them. I was about 13. My parents met them. I didn't meet them. I was I was looking from afar, but I was in I was in a birthday party with all of those people in, yes. Um, but yeah, it was pretty cool. I didn't know any of them, yeah. <laughs> Too goddamn young, Jenko. That's the problem. Um, oh, Jenko, you're from Essex, aren't you? Yeah, we just had somebody join Gaming Queen 1984, and they're from Essex. I just thought, I thought, yeah, you're from Essex, aren't you? I just was trying to uh, match them up. We've got like a buddy system here. I was trying to match people together so they're uh, they're not alone, you know. Yeah, I thought you were. How are you feeling after your uh, McDonald's? Are you fighting the demons still? It's like a very good party, yeah. There we go. Yeah, I just wanted to uh, initiate the buddy system. Something I like, like to do. If I can, we can't always, but um, yeah. Right, what we might do here is do a cheeky bit of driving the wrong way down the road. Because the game wants me to go, if you can see this, it wants me to go all the way round and come back in. We might just cross over. I'm still fighting demons. It's rough right now. 
for those who don't know, Sam has got quite bad acid reflux. I do as well. It's something that we, um, I, don't, I don't know if bond is the right word, but yeah, so he's fighting demons right now. I remember when I was about five, my dad took me to Anfield. I met the entire 90s Liverpool squad. Jesus, that is awesome. I'm also in, uh, I'm also in a newspaper at the Hillsborough, Hillsborough Memorial as my dad almost died. He got through the second gate before, oh my goodness. Nips, I cannot think of anything more traumatic than being involved in that. I know there's so many people lost their lives, but that must have been so scary for, for your dad. I'm glad they got out. We bond over acid reflux, yeah. That's the more posh side. Fellow gamer from Essex, Sam. He's a streamer. He's just starting out. So there's not just for you, Gaming Queen, but if anybody else is looking for an Essex-based streamer to hang out with, he's at, he's at university at the moment. He's just starting out. Yeah. Uh, we, we, I, I tricked him into playing Madison, which was great fun. He didn't enjoy it so much. Sam is not one for the scary games. Um, but yeah, I think, I think he had a good time. He may have had a good time. I'm not entirely sure. Cannot confirm nor deny that Sam had a good time. Uh, so if I, wait a sec. Right, we're gonna do a bit of jiggery pokery here. Cancel that task, but if I get this task here, why can I not get that task? Where have you, where have you gone? Yeah, here we go, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think I'm going the wrong way down this road, but it means we don't have to just perform like a 17 point turn. Right, who's this? Who have I not, who have I not given a ride to today? On hold at the moment. Welcome to help anyone out. Perfect. Um, playing Madison made me realize how shit I am. <laughs> See, there are some puzzle games I'm so good at. Talos Principle, um, Maquette, The Witness. But puzzles in horror, survival horror, or things like that, I just know. It's a completely different kind of puzzle. That's the thing. So I'm good sometimes. Nothing like that happened to it. Only a few murders every now and again. Uh, if I missed any chat, feel free to chuck it back in. Right, this person doesn't feel well, so we've got to be careful with this one. Now, the problem is I'm going the wrong way down this road, so we might immediately get bumped. Oh. Oh, shit. I failed it because I was reversing. Ah, okay. Okay. Yeah, I immediately failed because I was going the wrong way down a one-way one street. So that's unfortunate. But I think we've got one right beside us, though, that we can take instead. Um, wait a minute. If I... Okay, I, I think I've got myself into... An, I thought I was helping myself. I've got myself into a proper muddle. Let's go back. I thought I was going to cut some time out of this journey, but no. No, 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 no. Right, so we want to go this way. And then what we want to do, this is also one way. But if I go like this, if I reverse down the one-way street, this should work. Okay, I think we're getting there. The cavern. Yeah, I've, I, I think I would very much like to go to the cavern, yeah. Family members used to work at it. Oh my goodness. I like that you two are bonding. This is fantastic. Right, this is a timed one, okay. Don't cross the road, right. We're, we don't get put in prison for anything. We just got to... Uh, the rules don't apply when they want to go somewhere quickly. We get a tip for how quick we are. So let's try not to die along the way, but... Oh, typical red light. Come on, bitch, move. Move. Can I, can I pull over into there? Oh, no, we're going, we're going, we're going. Okay, let's go. Oh, shit, we've already had over half our time. But we don't need to obey any rules, so we might get lucky. No, I don't think we're going to make this one.
If I could do a handbrake turn in this, it'd be wonderful. She said, don't mind the laws, just get us there. Just don't kill us, basically. Oh, come on. Oh, nearly. Nearly. I nearly did it. Right, nearly. We, we are quite close. Two stars. Two stars. That'll be for the crash. That's fine. <laughs> oh, Darth, please. Please, Darth. Oh. Darth, Darth is... Unfortunately, Darth has brought us some bad news today. Kate Middleton has cancer. GTA 6 could be delayed to 2026 due to production delays. Oh, Darth, you're giving us the news. It's not great, but we thank you for it. Uh, yeah, that's that's tough. That's tough. Oh, really, Sam? That's a pretty good price, actually. There are some incredible places in the town centre. Nearly? That was not close at all. Hey, oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, can you imagine um, two members of your family being diagnosed with cancer within a, like a two, is it like a two month period or something? Wild, absolutely wild. Uh, we did get some money for it though. We did get a fairly decent tip, so not too bad. Right, should we do another challenge? I'm in the mood for it. Well, actually, who are you? Need to, actually, do you know what? We should probably um, repair our car. Let's go here first. Let's get some petrol. We'll charge the battery. And then we'll go and uh, fix up our car. It's probably looking a bit... Can you see it at the back? It's looking a bit... A bit mashed. Uh, I'm a big 5M player, so I'm excited for it. I heard it's going to be very creator-friendly. Oh, good. Yeah, we've got another member of the community that likes their GTA RP as well. I don't... I forget which... Um, which... What's the word? Server? Which server they use? But, um, yeah, they really enjoy it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the fact that um, Rockstar bought bought two of the big servers out is quite interesting, actually. They might even, um, yeah, I'm assuming it'll make GTRP a lot more immersive in the future. Does it, Sam? Fantastic. That's on my wish list. We're getting a lot of gaming news today. Thank you all for dropping it in. I'm looking forward to playing that. It gives me um, Under the Waves vibes, Sam, and obviously that's where we first met playing that game but yeah I think that could be good oh it's going to go this way oh, it wants me to go that way but I don't think I can so maybe I'll go this way instead 1800 hours wow that is impressive Oh, another flying car. Another flying car. Oh, break, 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 break. Jesus. We had another flying car incident. Don't know if anybody saw. Yeah, when your car takes damage in this game, your brakes go to shit. Very quickly.
That was too loud for me right now. Uh, the community is very close when you meet the right people. I'm in a motorcycle club and they are like family to me. That's like you're in a real life Sons of Anarchy situation, Preston, which is so cool. I love that for you. So it's, yeah, okay. It's taken me a very roundabout way to get to the uh, the other petrol station. We've used this one before. Um, I'm trying to use all of the, uh, the the car washes. I love it so much. I met some of my closest friends over it. Nice. Gin and tonics for my sister Ruth. Okay. This one is for Stacey. Hello. And if you could hand this one to my boyfriend. Fuck you. Whiskey. Thank you, Preston. Right. Missy beat you to it, Gibbsy, for the first time. I love that hijack one. Yeah, it's a very good TV show. It's a very good TV show. I still miss my jump. Have I removed it? Is it not still there? Why is it not there? It is, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love that one. I'd never remove that, ever. Oh my goodness, we've been raided. We have been raided. Welcome in, raiders. How are we doing today? How are we all doing? Let me do my, uh, my new ventriloquism act. Welcome in, raiders. If anybody needs to hydrate, get snacks, get away from screens, take your medications, please do. Self-care is very, very important. If it's anybody's first time here, why don't you tell me something about you? Let's get to know each other. There we go. The ventriloquism act. How are we doing? A deadly disciple. Welcome in. Princess Fluffy Bum. Welcome in. How are you both doing today? Thank you so much for coming in. Um, we're playing some Taxi Life, a city... Driving simulator today. How are you? How was your stream, Princess Fluffy Bum? It's lovely to see you. Uh, Deadly Disciple, yeah. Tell me something about you. Let's get to know each other. Missy beat you after a refresh, yeah. It's for me it was just like Missy and then you, so yeah. I like that everybody likes the whiskey shouts out. Impressive Plat Preston, I've been I've been working on my ventriloquism. Yeah. Um, but thanks so much for coming in, Raiders. Um, yeah, if you need to do anything, any post stream, please do. If it's your first time here, I'm from the UK. I stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Play games, get platinum trophies. We got one on Wednesday, Spider-Man 2. So yeah, I like I like the bling. I'm still pregnant, but other than that, I'm doing good. And stream was good as well. Fantastic. We've had somebody in the community that had a baby three weeks ago. Two and a half weeks ago. And Abby Tube Sock is um, due in July. So, yeah. Congrats. Congrats. <laughs> I think I remember you telling me this last time, actually. And I think I told you about Tubes in Zayat last time as well. So, yeah. Oh, Sam. That's a really good point, actually. When I hit... Um, I think... Shall I make it 1,500 on Twitch? Or shall I make 1,000 on YouTube? Due in two weeks. Princess Fluffy Bum. Very exciting. Yes, um, Zaya gave birth to Zuriel. Not this Tuesday gone, but I think a fortnight on Tuesday. A fortnight going backwards on Tuesday. So Zuriel is um, happy and healthy and uh, yeah, best of luck. And if you need us, we'll be here for you. If you need any, uh, you know, tips, got, I'm sure you've got plenty of people around you anyway, but if you need us, we'll be here. Just know I'm greeting new people in my heart, but I'm too dumb. <laughs> That's fine, Missy. I'll allow that. Missy is so tired in their soul today. So yeah, I'll allow that. 
Uh, I did just give birth a couple of weeks ago. I've been lurking, Zoe. We appreciate you. Yes, Princess Fluffy Bum is the next, the next one. Um, so yeah, I've been meaning to ask people this actually. I've got ideas for the plat ASMR that people have been asking for. Should I do it when I hit a thousand? Should I drop the first couple? They're going to be like twenty minute long, I think. I'm going to do like twenty minute episodes. Should I drop the first one when I hit, when I hit a thousand YouTube followers or fifteen hundred Twitch followers? What do we think? What do we think? Because yeah, I actually really want to do this. Um, let me. All right, shout out time. Let me give a shout out to our Princess Fluffy Bum. Where are my manners? Too busy talking about babies. Oh, maybe no, no clips. Or did I did I spell it wrong? Uh, oh no, I. Oh yeah, that's it. Yeah. I should remember that. Yeah, because you've got no eye, and Despair Bear has two eyes. So Princess Fluffy Bum, from now on, the law is. L-O-R-E, that um, Despair Bear stole your eye. That's going to be the new law. That's how I'm going to remember it. There we go. Hopefully it'll work this time. There we go. It's your fourth, so everyone's pretty much just left uh, left me alone about it. Fair enough. You're a pro at this point. You're a pro at this point. Yeah, I, d I don't know if Despair Bear is lurking at the moment, but if they are, I need to get the two of you to, uh, to know each other, and that's going to be the new law forever in this community at least. I'm going to give Despair Bear a shout out, actually. I'm going to do, actually, give Zaya a shout out, too. There we go. Yeah, this is Despair Bear. I do Bear. like this character, actually. I like the way that he has... With two eyes. Things. There we go. Law. He has things. I like the way he has things. <laughs> Does that make sense? I just really... Fuck's in here. Can you trap me in here? I heard a squeak. Something's gonna jump out. What the fuck? <laughs> but yeah, Princess Fluffy and Bob and Raiders, if you need to uh, do any post care, any post stream care, do what you need to do. We're gonna go back to uh, driving around in Barcelona. But some things never change. Well, yeah, best of luck. And uh, yeah, if you need us, we'll be here for you. Right, we're driving around Barcelona today. A bit of lo-fi music on the radio. Having a nice time. I can't remember where we're heading. I think we're heading to um, wash the car. Yeah, we're gonna wash the car. Let's go. I'll be lucky, no worries. Thank you so much for the raid. We'll catch up with you real soon. Oh, we're going, we're going this way. I was about to speed off down the road. Right, traffic lights in the intersection in front of you are not working properly, okay. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Not too difficult. Ooh, nearly. Oh no, we were fine. Felt like I was a bit closer than I was. I'm glad you're enjoying the music, Gibbsy. I do my best to get the, uh, the volumes right. And that's, that's just a curated playlist by me from uh, Pretzel Rocks, their lo-fi selection. It always feels like a good fit for a Friday. Oh, this person's turning as well.
right, this has, oh, this one has petrol, but no, there's no wash here, is there? Hmm, I was gonna try and wash the car, but this doesn't have wash the car capabilities. All right, let's go here instead and we'll fix up the car because we've taken a bit of damage. I've been playing, that was too close for comfort, it was. I've been playing guitar for like two hours now. Haven't had this much fun with it for a very long time. That's fantastic, Gibbsy. Very happy. I hope stream goes well. I'm going to go finish watching Sons of Anarchy for the bajillionth time. Good night, people. Have a great rest of your day, Preston. We'll catch up with you real soon. Might see you on Monday. Uh, yeah, glad you're connecting with the passion. Yeah, we need to go and fix up the car, I think. A little bit too much damage. This is the damage from when uh, we tried to nip between those two cars during the speed challenge. Why are you crossing? It's a green light. It's a green light. Oh, that, that, whoa. They just walked right through that car. Oh, so, oh my goodness. That's an interesting one. We've not seen that in, <laughs> we've seen some weird stuff happen in this game, but that is, that's pretty special. Okay. Thank you, Sam. Let's, um, let's move out. Let's get away from this. This place is haunted. Just peeking in to say hi. Got some stuff I need to do before the end of the work day. So got a look. But I hope stream goes, has gone well. Atlas, we appreciate you. We always appreciate a look from, from Atlas. Let me give you a shout out. Hope you, uh, hope you smash it at work. Hope everything goes super well. I hope you have a lovely weekend as well. Boop. I wish I had a marker. I would like to mark you. There's a bit of Hollow Knight, I think. Atlas is lovely. Go follow them. Lovely person. That ran away. Oh. He ran away, though. That's fine. It's fine. Tyria. Hello, Tyria. I saw your post today. Oh, they've just run a red light. They just ran a red light. <laughs> they just ran a red light. Thierry, I saw your post today in the Exercise Accountability channel. Congratulations. You're doing great. You're doing great. Um, how is your day going? I hope it's going really well. And uh, yeah, have you got any uh, plans for the weekend? If anybody wants to share their food that they've had today as well, we're always in the mood to hear. I've had some very interesting offerings today. Indy's making something, I couldn't pronounce it, but it's something to do with uh, Korean rice cakes, I think. Before we begin, you must all be warned. Thank you, Sam. Nothing here. I'm trying. You're it's doing vegetarian. great. Tyria, you're doing great. That's all I want what you else? to know. We see you. We value you. We appreciate you. You're doing great. Right, what's down here? Oh, yeah, we're doing some repairs. We took a little bit of damage. We were on one of the speed challenges. I'm gonna do some repairs. They are tempting you to commit a crime. It's true. I'm gonna go make a salad with chicken. Oh, lovely. What's everybody's favorite kind of salad? We don't talk a lot about salad in the channel. What's everybody's favorite kind? Uh, I will accept fruit salad. If, I know not everybody's interested in fruit salad. We had that conversation a while back too. But um, yeah, I like a Waldorf salad. A Waldorf salad's very good. Right, so I think a uh, full repair. There we go. Right, we're looking a lot nicer now. Perfect. That'll do nicely. Right, who are we picking up? Who are we picking up? Oh, I think somebody else is on a shift right now. So we might get some money from uh, one of our other drivers. Oh, Gibbsy. Pure, pure food porn. Shrimp, crayfish, avocado salad. No salad, I don't like mixing. Completely fine, Missy, completely fine. McDonald's salad, what's in a McDonald's salad? Out of curiosity. Hate any salad with meat. I love wakami salad. Oh. I didn't even know there was such a thing as a seaweed salad, Zaya. Oh my God. Yes, please. 
Sign me up for a seaweed salad. Been a minute since I've had a Waldorf. Do you know what? They're, they're um, I, I think there are different ways you can make them, but with the, uh, with white grapes. I like them with the grapes in. I like a Caesar salad. Yeah, I don't think you can really go wrong with a Caesar salad. That's my opinion. Yeah, very good. I'm on the fence about it. Well, do you know what? It's, it's, um, yeah, it's good to have opinions. Uh, where was I going? Oh yeah, we're just trying to pick somebody up now, aren't we? Oh, should we do another, ch I'm in the mood for another challenge, you know? Yeah, we'll do another challenge. Actually, chicken Caesar salad is my favorite. Thanks for reminding me that that one exists, Missy. There aren't too many salads I won't at least try. Agreed. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to try a seaweed one now. My mum loves a ham salad. Okay, okay. Um, I'm Zaya won't be having a ham salad, I'm guessing, but yeah, seaweed sounds good. Or you had a fried halloumi bacon honey walnut, walnut salad. That was fire. Walnuts are in a, um, a Waldorf salad as well. I'm not a fan of halloumi, but I'll take all the rest of it for sure. I like my vegetables prepared. Uh, sorry, I like my vegetables separated from each other, but everyone has their preference. And that is absolutely perfect. There's nothing wrong with that at all. Um, whatever works, whatever works. Oh, I think we need fuel. Right, next time I see a petrol station. Um, yeah, I'll tell you what, we'll go to, we'll follow the orange line, then we'll follow the blue line. I think these ones might be broken. Yeah, chicken Caesar salad's very good. I can't remember the last time I had it, but it's very good. Yeah, no, Dragon's Dogma 2 is getting quite a bit of pushback about the microtransactions. I like Supreme Pizza, burgers with all the toppings, salads with as much as I can jam in that tastes good. Tyria, I'm a big fan of when you have any kind of meal, putting a bit of everything on the fork. So when you have that that mouthful, there's a bit of all the flavors are in there. So uh, yeah, I think similar kind of vibe. Kind of want to make a salad now. What one are we thinking? What have we inspired you with, Gibsy? Which one have we inspired you? Yes, Tyria, yes. Um, in particular, and this is for all meals, but in particular, if I have a full English breakfast, bit of toast as the base, then you've got to get some beans on, some bacon on, um, yeah, whatever on there. Just got to get a bit of all the flavours. It's the only way to do it. Well, that's the good... <laughs> Missy, we love you just the way you are. Don't worry. Don't you worry. We love you just the way you are. <laughs> if we were all exactly the same, the world would be very, very fucking boring, wouldn't it? I'm glad that we're all, we've all got our differences. Yep, yep, yep. Tyria gets it. Don't forget, people, if you ever make anything nice or buy anything nice food-wise, 
feel free to chuck it in the Discord. We love to watch, we love to look at your food porn. We love it. Plates with sections. My mum loved those plates. Everything separate. Really? Yeah. I watched um, a YouTube short where they, it was quite interesting. You, you can buy these kind of, it's um, transparent on top and like a black flat thing on the bottom. And each, um, there was like a, a selection of carrots, like peppers, like all the things. But they said what people don't realize is that normally you take the lid off and they all kind of sit together. But if you do that, the lid, the, the roof of it, or like the lid, the transparent lid actually has sections in. So if you do that, they will all fall into different sections. It's more like a kind of serving bowl, but people never do that. They'll have it on the flat plastic where things are just like rolling around together rather than being separated in the lid. I never knew this this was a thing, but apparently it is. Uh, I'm kind of like you when I cook myself, but I always try to get as much, as many different things as possible when ordering, yeah. You see, when I go to a restaurant these days, or when I order, I will basically pretend it's tapas. Instead of getting um, like a starter and a main or a starter main and a dessert or a main and a dessert, I'll frequently get like four starters and just have little bits of this, little bits of that, little bits of this, little bits of that. That's when going to a restaurant or when ordering a takeaway as well. Um, my local Indian takeaway, five doors down, as people famously know, um, I will probably mostly get a bunch of starters and just pretend it's tapas, like the little sharing plates kind of situation that you get in Spain. I think it's a really cool concept of my poke bowl last night. No worries, Zai. You got too much on your plate as it is, so don't you worry. Poke bowl, gotta catch them all. It would be funny if you could get a trophy for running out of petrol. I don't think you can. I've been messing around with cruise control. I just realized I uh, missed my stop. We turn cruise control off. There we go. This has got loads left, I, I would imagine. Yeah. Um, so we're playing this today. Probably not playing it at all next week. Might come back to the week after. But yeah, this is, I, I don't even, we've not even got to 60% yet. So I don't know what the uh, the trophies are. Let's go. I don't imagine it'll be too difficult, truth be told, but. Oh, fuck. Have I got to go the whole way? Oh, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do a cheeky little bit of uh, off-roading. There we go. Save me a journey. We don't have much petrol at the moment, so I've got to make choices. Got to make life decisions. Actually, how close is the petrol station? Hmm. We'll do the journey, then we'll do the petrol station. The journeys normally aren't that long. Sorry, did I say journey? I meant challenge. The challenges aren't normally that long.
Right, do you want me to go fast or slow? Slow. Try not to break the speed limit. It's 30 here. <clears throat> I can't believe it's 30 here. We go so slow. Well, oh, we're more like 20, but I don't want to go anywhere. I don't want to go too close to 30. We might creep over it. I smell simmering caramel. I wonder what's cooking. <laughs> that sounds like a nice candle, though, Tyria. Um, we have somebody kind of adjacent to the community that makes their own candles. They're based in the US. So if you're ever looking for somebody who makes candles, feel free to uh, give me a message and I'll, I'll put the two of you in touch. I need to follow them, actually. They're very nice. It's just one of those things. I frequently see them in other people's chats and I never follow them. Yeah, we are desperate for petrol. I was looking at the petrol gauge. Person in front keeps brake checking me. being very law abiding I shouldn't be too mad it's like being in a rabbit warren Thanks, Sam. Yeah, I was just getting getting around to actually doing it. I looked at the playlists on YouTube. We went from Spider-Man 2, when we played it when it came out in October, I think. We went from that straight into um, Alan Wake 1, and then straight into Alan Wake 2. Then there was Robocop, there was Tintin, there was Assassin's Creed Mirage as well, I think. There just hasn't been the time. Just too many new releases, and then... Um, Oh, Skull Island Rise of Kong was that was, we were playing that still as well. Just hasn't been the time. But uh, once the new game plus came out, that was it felt like the perfect time to go back and excuse me. Grab all the rest of the trophies. Still need to go back and get the Mirage Platinum as well. Okay, can we go a bit faster now? Any danger of that? Right, it should be just up and down now. 
Is this 70 miles per hour, this section? Yeah, all right, let's go a bit quicker. Bactrian, hello Bactrian. Good to see you, friend. How are you? How's the world treating you? We're in the Barcelonas today. I've not killed anybody yet. But I did put a YouTube short out of my uh, a guy walking into my car last night and me getting punished for it. Oh, red light, red light, red light. Stop there. Just tired. How are you? Not too bad. We're having a good day. Very relaxing. Met some lovely people today. So, uh, yeah. Just chilling out in Barcelona. Bit of lo-fi. Who could want anything more? I must go and comment out. I appreciate you, Bactrian. I appreciate you. It does help the algorithm. We're doing a kind of a challenge uh, run at the moment, Bactrian, where we've got to take this person where they need to go without breaking any laws. Algorithm these nuts. Back to you know, I don't know if you and I talked about it, but we we found out about Kate Middleton today. I'm not sure if you heard the news. You might want to look on the internet and find the news. Take take a look on the internet and you'll you'll see. Hello. One second, I'll be right with you. I can see somebody that's just chatted there. There might be a new first time chatter potentially. I'll be with you shortly. Just trying to take this person where they need to go. We're doing a we're doing a challenge run at the moment where we can't break any laws. So I'm gonna do my best to just get them to where they need to go. Be right with you. There we go. I don't know. I think we might have gone uh, broken speed limits, but I think that might be it. So we might get a nice, a nice healthy tip here. Let me quickly pause it before we... How do we do? Five stars. Oh, I knew it'd be speed limit breaks. I knew we'd get the speed limit breaks. Uh, hello, have you tried the special missions yet? Driving as fast as possible with no speeding fines. We literally just did one. Yes, there are two types as far as I'm aware for special missions. One is you cannot break any laws. You've got to be really, really ultra careful because the passenger's not well. And we have done many of the speed ones as well. We have indeed, yes. Uh, welcome in. Uh, how are you today? Is this a game you're thinking of getting? Is it a game you have? Um, how did you find me? Let's get to know each other. Welcome in. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Uh, so yeah, we made a thousand tip. That's a big tip, Bactrian. A big old tip. Thank you. I just had a YouTube alert saying somebody's commented on my YouTube short, Bactrian. So thank you. I presume that was you. I appreciate you. I wish I could shout you out, Bactrian, but you're not a streamer. Yet. Platbrow. All that speculation. And they could have just left her alone. Yeah. Yeah. It, I, yeah, the fact that it's Charles and her as well. Yeah, such a shame. But I hope, you know, I hope they get well. But yeah, can you imagine two members of the family having cancer? Two members of the royal family having cancer at the same time. Oh my goodness. Yeah, but how, how is your day, Bactrian? I know you said you're tired, but have you been up to anything? Were you working today? Um, I know you're probably working at the weekend, aren't you? But yeah, we appreciate you around these parts. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I, I think we talked about this earlier. I would abolish the monarchy tomorrow. But they're human beings, you know, they're human beings. I'm not going to try, I don't, this isn't the time for anybody to be shitting on, on them, you know. 
Um, Elizabeth died last, was it last year as well? Like it's just, it's just never ending right now. It's like they're, like they're cursed, you know? That was a good, good bit of money. We're close actually to potentially getting our next taxi. How much have we got? 7,900. So we need 3,000 more. Oh, I tell you what I do need to do that. I desperately need petrol. Um, we might do, might take a very quick break actually. When I come back, we'll get petrol, and then we'll try and get the bus, like the like the minivan taxi. Uh, who wouldn't piss on me if I was on? <laughs> yeah, um, good way to put it. No, no, I I frequently use that expression myself, but yeah, yeah. Um, right, we'll be back shortly, and we'll uh, we'll try and get the next taxi, the minibus one. Back in a minute. Welcome back. Welcome back. Right, I need petrol. Where's the closest place to me that has petroleum? This is the lowest we've ever been on petrol, but I think we're going to be fine. Uh, another new comment on my clip. Thank you very much. I'm getting uh, notifications coming in. I appreciate you.
I'm having trouble mentally letting go of something good I don't want to let go of. Even though it's what I should do for my own good. That's a mood right there. Maybe a secret trophy if you run out, maybe. I'm not going to test it, though. Also, I know what you did. Gibbsy, what did you do? I'm presuming it's something good because it's Gibbsy and Gibbsy's lovely. How does this thing make you feel, Bactrian? The thing that you think you should let go of, how does it make you feel? Oh, a comment on the a comment on my on my YouTube short. No. <laughs> well, yes, that. You know, both. Okay, cool. Thank you. I appreciate you, Gibbs. I appreciate you, Bactrian. I don't think I was invited either. Oh, that thing I wanted you to do. Oh, I see. So did you did you um did you actually stream or was it a test stream, Gibbsy? Sorry to hear that. Sounds like it could be a marathon process kind of thing to let go of. So this thing, um, how does it make you feel? The thing you're, you're thinking that you might need to let go of, how does it make you feel? I think we're getting a bit of lag in this game, so I'm gonna start it again. It'll be fine eventually, just my brain being a hoe. <laughs> so are you, did you say you were debating whether or not you should let this thing go? Is that, is that what the debate is at the moment, Bactrian? Let's talk about it. black mark on my windscreen or is that something yeah I've got a black mark on my windscreen can you see that can you see that how weird right petrol station how close are we not close this was our last save spot I think Gibbsy, don't worry. Don't worry. We know Batrin. Gibbsy just wants to get it perfect. Absolutely perfect before they invite you. That's what it is. There's no need to apologize, Gibbsy. I know it can be very uh, stressful. You can, might have some anxieties, apprehensions about streaming in front of people. And so you're just keeping them secret for the time being. I did similar. Don't worry about it. We'll be there when you need us to be there. 
English word of the day. Transmission, a system of parts that transmits power from a car's engine to the wheels. Our type, thank you. We appreciate you. I hope you've had a good day, a relaxing day. And uh, yeah, if you just need to body double with us, listen to some lo-fi as we uh, traverse Barcelona, please feel free to do so. Thank you for the word of the day. Uh, oh, I'm not upset with you. I'm happy for you. I just like being a whiny baby because I adore you and I want to support you. Yeah. Oh, that taxi's in a rush. That's a competing taxi company. I mean, this is fine, isn't it? I mean, I'm basically behind the line. <laughs> basically behind the line. Welcome in, Jasper. Um, I know you've had a pretty big day today. Um, not for the best reasons, but I'm hoping you feel Hoping there's good news. I might be feeling positive, but um, if you just need to rest with us, feel free to rest with us. I have internet back, so I'm good. Has been storming outside. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Big fan of the storms. Big, big fan of the storms. Right, green light. Anybody on the crossing is getting squashed. I don't care anymore. We need some petrol very urgently. I like big taxis and I cannot lie. Viper, welcome in. How are you? Good to see you. Welcome back to Barcelona. How's your day been? Is anybody got any plans for the weekend? If you're lurking, feel free to remain lurky turkeys. But um, yeah, just body double with us. Listen to the music and uh, enjoy Barcelona. Bless me. I'm alive still so far. That sounds like a good week to me. Sounds like a very good week. Rest still waiting on test results, but he did survive the surgeries. So now just hoping that they can extend my grandfather's life. That is great news, Jasper. That is great news. Happy to hear it. Um, we've all got our fingers crossed and are sending, uh, you know, thoughts and prayers and that kind of thing. But yeah, happy to hear it. You probably had a stressful day, Jasper, so feel free to just park it up and uh, listen to the music and bask in the beautiful sunny Barcelona. No plans, just been chilling, re-watching certain parts of Westworld. Interesting. Certain parts. Tell me the certain parts because, uh, yes, Westworld was an interesting experience. I will be just waiting here until Monday. Sigh. What's that in relation to? I might have missed something. Uh, well, most stress was released by the good news. Fantastic. Yeah. I've never seen it, but is it the nude part? I would say it's season one, if I had to guess. So basically episode one. Do you mean season one? The last episode of every season. Yeah, I've only seen seasons one, two, I think half of three. But I mean, even two, I was just losing interest with the, with the direction they went with it. Season one, though, I'll take a bullet for. If anybody comes to me and they say, I admit this has actually happened. People have said to me, look, I'm not really into sci-fi, but we've got a lot of good sci-fi films and TV out at the moment. Could you could you recommend a, a, like an intro, a good introduction for me to sci-fi? I always tell them Westworld season one is spectacular. Very good. Very, very, very good. Right, we need petrol because we are super duper duper low on petrol. So I figured I would go back. Yeah, it just... Uh, yeah, we won't go into it. It just got a bit weird. 
a bit weird for me. Oh, am I in the wrong lane? No, I think I'm okay. I think I'm just about okay. <laughs> yeah. I think even when the creators say they, they disappeared up their own asses, then you're like, yeah, then you know. <laughs> then you know there's a problem. Why does the sat nav keep changing like while I'm crossing the road? Damn it. I can understand why someone would have a hard time getting into science fiction stuff. A lot of them expect you to learn a lot about their universe very quickly. Yeah. Um, I think season one of, of Westworld was just... I felt like I was somebody going to Westworld, the, the, the theme park, or like the, the park. But yeah, season two, they experimented with non-linear narrative. And ever, ever since I watched Memento, which is my favourite film, I've been um, kind of obsessed with, obsessed with non-linear narrative. But the problem is, they... Um, if I like non-linear narrative and I think it was misused, then you've got a problem. They just got, they made it too complicated for the, I think the average audience goer. And I, I would consider myself to be that. And then I think season three, I won't go into what's in season three because I guess it could be considered spoilers, but it just, it became quite dull. Kind of, kind of, I think they, they took all the, the non-linear nar narrative stuff out. And they tried to kind of course correct in that way, but there was nothing left. It was just, it got a bit boring by that point. So there was nothing to really grab me anymore. Uh, the Witcher show did that with season one and it didn't work very well. I'm trying to think of other, um, like stories I've seen where, where it was used well and did work well. Um, it, it, it's, you, you can probably list them on one hand of where it really comes off. But it wasn't just the creators, it was the WB Discovery merger that effed everything up. In what way did that F everything up for the um, for Westworld? I'm curious to know, actually. Um, but yeah, Memento, I love. Love Memento. Petrol Station, finally. We are very close to being out. So this is coming a good time for us. Uh, are we going in? Oh, we're just pulling into this one. Oh no, that's the wash, isn't it? Yep. Really interesting. my gas station bill do you know what i might wash the car as well wash the car as well What's the weirdest movie you've heard about? Because I was told about a weird one today. Um, I, I mean, you can probably go the horror route with it, something like The Human Centipede. But isn't there a part, isn't there like an animated film called, is it like Sausage Party or something? Something like that? Which it sounds really weird to me. I've seen like trailers as well. Not, uh, not gonna say the name. Space movie from 1992. Yeah, maybe maybe a will later. Um, yeah, I can't think of any weird films I've seen off the top of my head. Uh, right, who are we going to pick up? Oh, should we do another challenge? That's how we make the big bucks, through challenges. A uh, thing on YouTube, and they said one of the actors wanted 15 million. Really? Did, 
so is it still going? Because I thought there were only four seasons seasons out, but maybe I'm that far removed from it because of um, I just kind of fell out of love with it. Oh, I think that's going the wrong way, isn't it? I had, um, what did I have today? I had some fish today, it was very nice. There was only four seasons because of the demand from the actors in the show and the fact that the show was getting too expensive for HBO. Um, season five never came to into fruition, interesting. Yeah, I did not know about that. Yeah, it seemed like it kind of petered out, but I'll always remember season one. I can't even imagine what season four is about. I might have to watch it just out of curiosity. It looked like it had very high. Yeah, I might do. I might do actually, just to, just out of curiosity. But it always looked like it had high production value, you know. This song is too loud. Yeah, just out of curiosity, just to see, um, just to see what it's like, to see what they did with it. Right, they're in a big hurry. Let's go. Let's go. I try not to kill them on the way. Oh, is it this one? Yeah, it's this. Oh shit! Good day, sir. I said good Thanks day, for the sir. lurk. Not sure who it is. So I'll be back in shortly. Oh, don't be parking there. Thanks, Viper. Okay, we're not doing that apparently. Yeah, this went bad real quick. Shit. And then the lights turned green, didn't they? Obviously. Oh, and then they turn red again. Fuck. Yeah, fuck that one up real bad. Shit. Ah. <sighs> Yeah.
Yeah, that was my mistake. I thought riding the bre at the uh, pavement would be the be best thing to do. But, um, yeah, I fucked it up. Fucked it up. Uh, let's try this one. Yeah, but they say in this, you, it, with the speed ones, you can break the law. They said there are no consequences. They say, get me there quick and the laws be damned. So I tried to, oh, the game's frozen now. Fuck. Yeah, I'm annoyed about that. Yeah, the ones that where they want you to go, uh, to go slowly, they say obey every law. I'll be very upset if you uh, break the law. The speed ones, they say it doesn't matter about the laws. Just get me there as quick as possible and you'll get a big tip if you do. Doo -doo. Uh, I can't remember, actually. I honestly can't remember. We want to get a going to get one of these. Yep, let's go. Uh, start the car. I hope you enjoy it. It's good fun. Right, now the challenge coming up. Was it going to be a fast one or a slow one? That's the question. We're probably about two challenges away from getting the, uh, the, the taxi bus. And I might drive that one around, actually. It's going to be a bit different than this one. This is the smallest taxi you can get. And I think the bus is the biggest one you can get. So uh, I think we can do some of the... Um, there are certain types of fare that we, we can't do with such a small taxi. but uh, Because I think they need like four... I think they need like six seats or something. So yeah, we might be able to do some different kinds of missions. Let me park you there. Right, would you need fast or slow? Hurry. Yeah, hurry. Let's go. Right, let's try not to fuck it up this time. Just don't kill us. Yep, laws be damned. Got it. Oh, red lights. Always red lights. Okay, go, 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 go. Go, move. Can I sneak in here? Just about. Just about. Oh, I think I've done that wrong. Potentially, I can cut through here. This might be one way, though, so we'll see. See how lucky we get. Move, move, car, move. Shit. Oof. How do we do? 
Only three stars. Small collision. Yeah, I think that last collision might have cost us a little bit. Cost us a little bit of money. Uh, okay. 700 euros. Still not too bad. Um... What have we got now? So we've got 8,300, so we need 2,700, I think, to be able to get the bus. So can we grab you? Doing a quick detour to get there a bit quicker. Double decker bus, that'd be pretty sweet, wouldn't it? All right, in a hurry, let's go. Don't crash the car, don't slow down below 40. Understood. I'll do my best. Ah, the brakes weren't good enough. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no way. No way we're getting out of this with a good review. The brakes did not like that at all. Oh my God, we're stuck together. We were stuck together. Yeah, I think we've gone the wrong way as well. There are no side streets. Oh, I was hoping a side street would take us over. No, I've absolutely fucked this one up. No chance. I can't find any way into where this is. Shit. Clipped. Yeah, we're going too fast now. Clip the curb. Oh, we're through a lamppost. No, fuck that one up bad. How are we doing? Oh, the Ryans are here. The Ryans are here together. Oh, damn it. Clearly, therefore, clearly, yeah. How you doing, Ryan? How you doing, Ryan? Hope you're both well. All right, let's see if we can find another one. I might need to repair the car. Or I can maybe try and get this one instead. Not too bad, not too bad. Having a nice, well, it was quite relaxing up to that point. I tried to do the speed challenge and uh, yeah, I fucked it up quite badly. I keep um, getting fucked up by red lights. That's the issue. Uh... Right, let's see if we can find another challenge. I might need to repair the car first, potentially. So where am I? I think we've got to turn around. That might be the issue. There we go. Right, at least we're on the right. Oh God, at least we're on the right track now. Yeah, I tried to be a bit clever in the last one. Tried to find a shortcut. Didn't work out at all. Then we hit some red lights and then I clipped a few curbs and the rest of his history. Oh, damn it. I think we clipped that little 
Did we click that plant? Might have done. Uh, Johnny, welcome in. How are you? I do recognize the name. It says you're a first time chatter, but I do recognize the name. Uh, Missy, I'll see you on Monday. Have a great weekend. Yeah, Johnny, I recognize the name. But it says you're a first time chatter. We've crashed the car a bit, but there's no excuse to kill people. If you walk back across, I'll be very upset with you. That is fine. All right, let's go. We'll do this uh, challenge and then we will repair the car. I mean, it's not looking too bad. It's not looking great, but it's not looking too bad. Oh, 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 don't bump into me. I'm picking somebody up. Thank you. There we go. Is that a super AC? Hello, super. Oh, shit, they're in a hurry. They're in a hurry. I'll be back with you in a second, super. Game's going well. We're trying to do some of the speed challenges at the moment, and I keep crashing. So it's going well, but it could be going better. Oh, Jesus. It's going well, but it could be going better. How is everything with you? How are the, uh, how's your new channel, the new brother's channel going? Go, 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 go. Why are you so slow? Have I got to go down the pavement? Oh, but if I do, I'll kill loads of people. Oh, there's so much. Oh my God. There's so much fucking traffic. This is probably not going to work. <laughs> oh God. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Barely. Barely. Right, I don't think we're going to get much of a tip because we wasted a ton of time, but we can we can try. Oh shit! Oh shit! We got into a proper waggle there. Yeah, the steering's not it's not quite GTA Five, but I I, mean, I am trying. Oh, yeah, the the. Uh, the cars in this game, they're not quite capable of some of the speeds I'm putting into them. Uh, for the Monday, I had to go fast, babysitting my nephew on short notice. Oh, fair enough. Well, welcome in. Um, whereabouts are you from? Um, yeah, tell us something about you. What kind of games you like to play? Good bud. The new channel is going great. Fantastic. Fantastic. It's um, often on quite late hours for me, but I will try and swing in again when I can. Glad you uh, glad the brothers are... Uh, Having a, having a shared interest, having some bonding time. Uh, right, let's see if we can. I think we've got to repair. Probably got to repair the car. Uh, taxi jobs, challenges. Maintenance, I need to put maintenance back on. There we go, yeah. So the next, is this the nearest one? Yeah, we'll go here. The Netherlands, so many people following recently from the Netherlands. I'm not sure, I, I must be doing quite well over there. The algorithm loves me in the Netherlands. Very weird. Yeah, Jasper's from the Netherlands. Um, yeah, we met some lovely people from there quite recently. Shoot in the morning when I can, perfect. Yeah, I'll, I don't think I ever get, I think, I'm not sure what time you stream compared to when I stream, but I think I'm more likely to see your brother's stream potentially. I'm not sure. We'll have to, we'll have to see. But yeah, I dropped in to see your brother playing. It wasn't, was it Madison? It might've been Madison. Uh, probably, yeah. So in case anybody's just coming in, we're playing the uh, Taxi Life, a city driving simulator. But what we're trying to do is some of the speed challenges and the car quite, <laughs> the car quite, can't quite handle it. We're trying to go around some of these corners super duper quick. And um, yeah, it's fun. It's a very good game, but it ugh, the cars aren't quite built for these speeds. Uh, Viper Venom Gaming, I'm on a quick break. Welcome back. We're nearly, we nearly have enough money to get the, um, the next taxi. So that's what we're saving up for. Jasper, we can't yet, but I'm hoping DLC potentially uh, in the future might be for some different cities. It could be quite fun. 
Could be nice. You never know. Uh, yeah. Okay. We're nearly back to the uh, to the workshop. What time is it in game? Actually, oh, it's actually nearly evening anyway. I don't like to drive in this game in the night time, so we might sleep through to the morning. Yeah, see, when you've taken a lot of crashes, your brakes just don't work. They do not work. Look at, look at the car, look at all the scratches on it. Look at the crumpling. More of a morning person then? Uh, me, no. No, I'm very much a late night person. But I think, um, I think, the game reminds me of uh, GTA taxi missions, even the map looks similar, yeah. Yeah, um, so what was I saying? Yeah, so I'm, I'm not a morning person at all. So I think that's, and I'm probably, I, that might be why I'm missing supers, but I think I'll be more in line to see their brothers, who streams later. Um, I started to say I love it so far. We're going to be streaming it Monday, Tuesday, potentially Wednesday. And we're calling it Rise of Ron. So we're going to have loads of commands to do with Ron Burgundy, um, Ron Weasley, uh, Ron Swanson, for people to pepper in as we do the stream. But yeah. I'm, I'm cautiously optimistic, but I, I've heard some, I think people have been quite mixed about it. Like generally positive, but a little bit mixed. So I'm hoping for the best. I'm glad you're really liking it though. Um, I loved Ghost of Tsushima. So it's not obviously not exactly the same, but it's got kind of a lot to live up to. Um, yeah, probably he's crazy. Yeah, playing Madison. Yeah, I Jenko's playing it as well at the moment. My bro stream at night in our time zone. I stream in the morning. Yeah, yeah. Traffic is no joke in this game. Yep. I think it gets to the point sometimes where I just say, do you know what? I do my best to be a law abiding citizen, but sometimes you just got to, yeah, see, no brakes because we're so, our car has taken so much damage. So we're going to have to nurse this back to uh, the workshop. Oh, flying cars. Did anybody see the flying cars? We've been seeing quite a few of them the past two streams. Yeah, it's wild. The pedestrians are wild themselves, but um, yeah, we get some other interesting AI stuff. Los Santos Customs, yeah. We're going to the equivalent. Go to the equivalent, let's go down here. Right, we need to fix the car up and then we're trying to get 11,000 euros so we can get the bus. Uh, so we can pick up groups of four or more. And then we will have a fleet of four taxis in the city. I'm probably going to drive the bus for a bit. It's it's not a bus. It's like a, like a six-seater van situation. But I think I might drive that one. We've been driving this one. It's the nippy small one, which is probably the best one for the speed challenges. But yeah, um, the bus might, might have different kinds of challenges. You never know. So let's just cruise up here. Try not to kill anybody. What's wrong with her now? They fixed the car from explosive damage. Yeah. Yeah. This one I've been, uh, been joyriding. So super, tell me about um, Rise of the Ronin. Tell me what, like, what, what's it like? You know, no spoilers, obviously, but what's it like? What are you liking? What are you not liking? Yeah, you, you actually can. Why don't I show you? Uh, so if you, if you look at this, this has actually reminded me we've got skill points to use that I never do. If you look over um, at this line here, I bought all of the law obedience skills first, obviously. The first one allows me to... Um, uh, one ticket per day is cancelled. It can be for speeding, things like that. Uh, photogenic. Fines from photo radars cost less money. Uh, law obedience. You gain more experience from uh, for abiding by traffic rules. Uh, two tickets a day are cancelled. And then this one is um, hitting a pedestrian takes less money. 
Oh my goodness, we're being raided. We're being raided. I'll use the rest of those skill points now, actually. I completely forgot they existed. Welcome in, raiders. Welcome in. Good day, sir. I said good day, sir. Welcome in, raiders. If anybody needs to make weight, get snacks, get away from screens, take your medications, please do. Self-care is very, very important. If it's anybody's first time here, why don't you tell me something about you? Let's get to know each other. Welcome Raiders, LX, welcome in. How was your stream? Hope it went really well. Any Raiders, if you need to do any post stream stuff, please do. I stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Uh, yeah, we play games and we get platinum trophies. I hope everybody's doing okay today. How was your stream, LX? What were you playing? Was it Phasmo Friday? I think it might be a Phasmo Friday for you. Um, what have you missed? We we are nearly we nearly have enough money to get the bus. We want to get the big taxi. It is Phasma Friday. I thought it might be. Yeah, we need another two thousand ish. Oh, Tagira, welcome in. I hope you're doing well, Tagira. We had a fourth Swedish person here today, Tagira. And Gibbsy and Missy are the three uh, Swedish people that I know in this community. We had a fourth person here today. Very exciting. The Swedish community continues to grow here. Uh, hello. Uh, Nick, welcome in. I'm new on Taxi Life. If you go further in the game, can you like expand your company and stuff? Or how do you upgrade your company? Great question. Your name is like a composite of several people in this community. So I wondered if it was a comp <laughs> I wondered if Nick Dude and DB had um, come together to, to make a new identity. But welcome in. Um, let me show you. Instead of talking about it, why don't I show you? Um, so these are my two other drivers and my two other cars at the moment. Um, the SMC and the Aphelion. But I think, what was the plan? Yeah, we're actually in the garage right now. So you've come in at a good time, Nick. I can show you. Um, this is our car that has been a bit bashed up. So why don't I just repair you quickly? If you go to... Yeah, that's how you deal with your employees. Um, if you go to cars, you can buy new taxis. These are all the taxis you can buy. This is the one we're trying to buy. It's 11,000. That's the one we're trying to buy at the moment. Um, you can get new parts for your cars, as you can see here. I'm looking forward to getting some new tires, actually. Uh, you can customize the interior and the exterior. And then you can rest so you can sleep, which is what we're probably going to do now because I don't like driving in the evening in this game. Um, so, yeah, you go here. This is where you buy new cars. And then you go to... How do you hire new people? I've forgotten. Is it through maintenance? Or management, sorry. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can go here and this is how you hire new people. Does that make sense to you, Nick? If you got, I'm sorry if I'm going too quickly. Feel free to ask me any questions. to ground for basically fantastic while you're here nick why don't you tell us about you whereabouts are you from what kind of games do you like to play um i'm a variety streamer from the uk i stream monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday 6 p.m gmt and on monday and tuesday next week we're going to be playing rise of the ronin and on thursday and friday next week we're going to be playing suicide squad kill the justice league i'm not sure about what wednesday is going to be yet i'm not sure about that yet but um yeah so what did we want to do? I think we wanted to do some repairs, didn't we? Um, we can probably, yeah, let's refuel while we're here as well. But we're not gonna wash the car. There's a reason we're not washing the car. Uh, yeah, refueling. Perfect. So we do need to wash the car. So where would be the next one we'd go to? Um, yeah, so there is a trophy. There was a trophy for using every petrol pump um and so I, i'm guessing there's going to be one for using every power uh, car wash 
I'm from Belgium, live in the UK, and mainly play League of Legends. But I do like to play simulator games myself. Fantastic. We have somebody in the community that is from Colombia that now lives in Belgium. Um, but we also have, I think, um, other people live in Belgium too. We have somebody that's lived, um, two people that were from Portugal that now live in the UK as well. So we're quite a metropolitan, uh, sorry, cosmopolitan um, community. We've got loads of people here from Central Europe. Uh, we've got people from Sweden, got people from Finland, got people from Norway, Germany, Spain, um, other countries as well. Um, so yeah, welcome in. Oh, Netherlands too. Loads of Netherlands people. Jasper's from Netherlands. Uh, lots of immigrants here. Yeah, yeah. But you're very welcome here. Thank you for stopping in. I would love to visit all those places. <laughs> so would I. I've been to quite a few of them, but not all of them. Um, yeah, we play a bit of Power Wash Sim here as well. Uh, I'm also Dutch. Yes, indeed. Uh, Nick, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Yeah, we've got, I can think of at least four people that are Dutch in the community as well. It's so expensive to fly out of Canada, but Canada seems so nice. Super. We've got loads of people from Canada in the community too. Uh, Mint Tea. Hello. Good to see you. The caption of this stream is so unhinged. I love it. How's it going? I'm finally done with work until Tuesday. Um, super. I don't know if you know Zaya, but you are both from Canada. This is one of the Canadians I was talking about. Uh, Minty, how, how are you today? Uh, finally done work until Tuesday. That's fantastic. Great to hear it. What are your plans for the weekend? What have you been bribing yourself with to get through the week? Canadian high five. Um, Minty, can you remind me where you're from? I still feel like we're in the getting to know you phase and my memory is not notoriously bad. So it does take me about six times to remember where people are from. But yeah, we're just talking a little bit about, um, I guess, where everybody's from. Yeah, we've got a very mixed group of people here. Um, loads of UK people joining recently as well. The title, haha, <laughs> I want to ride. Yeah, yeah, I like, I think um, we're known here for being a bit, you know, it's an 18 plus stream, so. Uh, oh, here we go. Can somebody do exclamation mark food, please? Doing well, making some lemon shrimp fettuccine. Going to play some Stardew tonight. I read my books from America, Eastern Before we Time begin, Zone. You must Perfect. All be warned. So Nick and uh, anybody else that's new here, we're, we're big foodies here. We love to talk about food. But whenever we do, we have to do the dinner gong first. Mads will say bon appetit to us and then we can talk about food. So yeah, we're known for uh, the food. We're known for the lewd. But we're also a community full of people with chronic health issues as well. So yeah, we've got a lot going on. I just finished eating dinner. Do you want to share what you had, Super? I won't guess poutine. I won't guess poutine. Maybe it was poutine. But we've, um, we've been talking a lot about poutine this week as well. How all of us want to try it. But many of us haven't had it. So we need to go to Canada and uh, seek it out. Chili. Nice. Going all day. I love a chili. I don't like kidney beans. That's my own issue. Poutine is amazing. So I'm told by so many wonderful people. I believe it. Got to experience it now. Um, yeah, Nick, if you've got any more questions about the game, don't hesitate to ask, by the way. Um, I'm going to do this again just so I, it turns me around. There we go. Right, we need about $2,000. Had pancakes for dinner, nice. Fried chicken for lunch. Have hubby's leftover poutine for dinner. Oh, magnificent. I love to cook. My sister is an amazing baker. I'm more of a savoury chef. We've got, it's really weird you say that, Minty, because um, we've got another pair of sisters in the community. One is very good at savoury and one is a very good baker. So, yeah, that's that's quite funny. Um, actually, I'm sorry, I, pre I presumed gender. I don't know. I, I Yes, we, we, I do, we, do, we do have two sisters who are good at cooking. So, yes, I've no clue what your gender is, but yeah. Um, had an amazing Nando's today, not complaining. Cheeky Nando's. Cheeky Nando's, I like it. Uh, yeah, oh, I'd like to try some poutine. Everybody's talking about it all the time. I need to I need to get over there. I need to give it a go. Right, we're going to try and find... That is funny, do not worry about that. My pronouns are she, her, hers. Okay, I mean, I... Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I, maybe I knew. Maybe I'd seen it in another stream and it was subconsciously in there. But uh, yeah, I try not to, you know, try to be better with my pronouns in general, so... Uh, I don't get good poutine where I am from. I am jealous. 
meatballs and leftover goulash. Oh, Jasper, I remember you talking about the goulash yesterday. Yeah. Yeah, very good. Right. Let me see if we can find a place to clean the car first. Where should we go? Should we try here? We've got to raise 2,000 and we're, getting, uh, we're going to get the next, uh, the next taxi. We're going to get the big taxi, the six-seater taxi. Right, let's... Ooh, red light. Let's not drive over anybody. My favourite poutine place shut down, unfortunately, but they had over 100 different types of poutine. Zaya, that reminds me of a place near me. Right, before I tell you the story, does anybody like mussels? As in moule. As in moule marignan. Does anybody like mussels? I'm a big seafood fan. Such a tough time getting used to driving on the right side at the beginning of this game. Oh my god, I've been, I've been, yeah, frequenting the wrong side of the road in this game. I think, I think this is right. I think this is correct. Oh god, I don't think it is. I think I just chopped a few people. Got a bit of a waggle on there. It was called the whistle stop, and it's so sad it's gone. I'm so sad it's gone. I haven't lived anywhere near it for quite some time, but I would commute just to have their poutine. So anyway, the place near me, seafood place near me, they did mussels 50 ways. And you'd get this thing, it was like a little like a little passport, and it'd have all the 50 ways. And every time you went there, you could stamp off a different one. So you could try and, um, the, the the, uh, you'd have to like try and get all of them try and have all of them I think you got like a reward if you tried all of them so Jasper Volcana Zaya Super are all from Ontario I think we might have a few more as well it's a popular one I think Jasper was telling me the percentage of the population that lives in Ontario, so it's um, it's odds on, but still. I think we got somebody from Quebec as well. They're an outlier. Anyone else from Northern Ireland? We've got we've got Leah. I think I don't. I think they're Republic, but that's the closest I've got for you, unfortunately. I'm 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 huge in the Netherlands and Sweden. Apparently, really, I'm not as well known in in, in Ireland. I'm sorry to say. Uh. Anyone from Chelsea, West London? Nick, are you a Chelsea fan by any chance? I know you're, uh, you've are you moved to London, but yeah, my, my allegiances are to North London. I was born in West London, though. I will sing, I will be, uh, start singing your praises to the locals. Please do. The fact I'm half Irish as well, really, it's, it's yeah, it's a bit embarrassing. Gonna eat, uh, Jasper's recipe tomorrow. Nice. Yeah, it's embarrassing. I'm not doing well in the uh, the motherland. Minty. Zaya. Jasper. I'm not from Ireland. <laughs> Bactrian, welcome back. Yes, Minty's joined us. Now, we wouldn't know Minty if it wasn't for Bactrian. So uh, we thank you, Bactrian. We're still doing our raiding new people every stream in March. And we're meeting some lovely people. We really are. We, we, we raided somebody, an, um, a Dutch streamer, not too long ago. So yeah, the, the Dutch population in the community is growing. Season ticket holder since 0910. Nice. I'm an Arsenal fan. I'm, ne I'm nearly at the top of the waiting list for the season tickets as well. Uh, 
uh, oh, this has, have we been to this one before? Out of curiosity, have I washed my car here? I don't know, we'll try it though. I could tell some of my friends about you to make you more famous in the Netherlands. It's, that'd be, you'd be very kind, but um, it's okay. We're doing quite well organically. We'll, we'll get there, we'll reach them, reach them eventually. Aris Laberb speaks Dutch. It's a good name, Aris Laberb. Yeah, yeah. We didn't have a sugar daddy, unfortunately. Uh, how do I get in here? I think I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Yeah, I think this is one way. It's fine, we'll be fine. Right, let's see if we can wash the car here. Oh, oh no. Oh no, 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 we don't want to do that. I thought it was going to take me like robotically for a second. I think I just didn't have the brake, the brake pedal on. Why is it not working? There we go. Yeah, but it, it's, Roman owned it for Roman. The people that bought Chelsea were like a group of people. Isn't it like an American um, insurance fund or something? Isn't it people's pensions? So they've got, they don't give two shits either way. Like Roman wanted Chelsea to win. Todd Bowley doesn't care. So yeah, you need a sugar daddy that actually cares. So, uh, but yeah, I think we all knew this was, we, we all knew Todd Bowley was never gonna, it was never gonna work because they got into it for the wrong reasons. Roman got into it, I think, even though he seems to be not a very nice person, he got into it for the right reasons, reasons at least. Uh, I'm on baby duty, gonna have to lurk again. Nice to meet you, Super. Lovely to see all you wonderful folks. Give our love to the baby. We appreciate you both. Right, let me do some, let's do some journeys, shall we? Instead of sugar, say suka. Oh. All right, let's go this way. Let's try not to crash the car. That'll be if that's possible. Easy now. Easy. How do we get out of here? These places are always so difficult to leave. Maybe I was supposed to go left. I don't know. I, don't know. I think we're out now. That's all that matters. Can I sneakily go the wrong way? Looks like I can. Roman was an absolute legend. It just looks like Todd wants to basically copy Brighton's philosophy, but with bigger budget. Going to sleep, have work again tomorrow, and two large groups want a buffet. Have a good one, Jasper. We'll catch you soon. Um, yeah, I think I think they wanted it as part of an investment portfolio, and I hate that. I want people that are passionate about sports to be allowed to buy sports teams, but um, yeah, it's, it's just very sad. I think there's more chance of Chelsea getting relegated than winning the Premier League at the moment. It's a sad state of affairs. All right, let's go this way. Type. When I was at university, there used to be a, uh, a food truck that came onto the campus every day, and all they did was pad thai. All they did was pad thai. I fucking love pad thai.
It's a rainy day in Barcelona. We don't get too many of those. It was an interesting conversation. Nice. Very nice. Oh, fuck. Damn it. I was just looking at the map at the wrong time. Uh, I wish they didn't regulate the food trucks out of my city. Oh, that's sad. That's sad. Yeah. I, yeah. That's the first proper like kill we've had since I think the first stream. But yeah, they they just love to dip out at the last second. That woman is dead, yes, that woman is dead. Right, that means we need another person to pick up. Because that cancels the trip. Um, what about you? What about you? And not you. Rest in peace, stupid NPC. Yeah, Missy will be sad that they missed that. They love to watch the uh, the the deaths. I don't think I was even going particularly fast, but yeah, doesn't matter. Yeah, I put a YouTube short out earlier today. And it was of an NPC walking to my parked car. They, my, my car was completely stationary. Um, and they walked onto my onto the bonnet and they died. Uh, I would love, uh, it would be cool having multiple cab drivers in the city. Nick, I'll be honest with you, I think there's 0% chance of that happening. Um, I don't think that's the vibe they're going with for this. Um, a few people asked me that on the week of release. I, don't, I just don't see it. They want to, it's, it's intended to be a very kind of sedate experience, but you never know, it's possible. Uh, LX, thank you for being here, thank you for the raid. I'll catch up with you real soon. Easy now, easy now. Let's try not to kill anybody else if we can help it. I was there for that one, I'll show up in court if you need, I appreciate you, I'll tell. Thankfully, we've got the receipts. YouTube remembers. <laughs> she came out of nowhere. Your Honor. Yeah, that's what we were saying. Have you seen um, Better Call Saul, Nick, or anybody in chat? Because it was very much like a slip in Jimmy kind of thing, where Jimmy McGill would um, pretend to get knocked over by cars. It was very much that vibe. It's The light is green. Okay. I gave that person as much time as I possibly could. There we go. Green light. You shouldn't be on the the uh, on the crossing when it's green light. Right, another passenger about to be uh, 
Oh, I've not seen it actually, Nick. When was it announced? Was it announced today? I've not seen it. Or who I who you think who I think should be in it? Is that what you mean? Your Honor, she was looking angry at me, so I had to. I had to. Green light, perfect, perfect. Here we go. Um. I've not really paid much attention to it. I don't like the international break, if I'm being honest. It just annoys me. I like international tournaments, but the these little friendly matches, I just don't give. I don't care. I just wish it could be the Premier League. I wish there wasn't an interruption, you know. Um, I think Mainu is interesting. Oh, hello, Zartu. How are you? I think, um, is it Mainu? What's his name? Something Mainu? I'm not a Man United fan, I can't remember, but he seems like a good prospect. What I'd really like us to do in the Euros is basically just go all out attack. We're blessed with some of the best attacking, my well, best attacking um, footballers we've had for generations. So I think we should try and win every game 5-0. And if we lose, we lose. But I think we play too defensively and we've got just some amazing talent there right now. That's what I would do. Just play six up front every game. Bellingham and Caton. Mainu. Start every game. Just been playing some 8-bit indie games. Oh, nice. Nice, nice. That's fantastic. The first 8-bit game I think I ever played was um, Sonic the Hedgehog. The 8-bit Sonic the Hedgehog game. Really enjoyed that. Yeah, I played some like 3.5-inch floppy disk stuff before then. But when I got a Master System 2, that was 8-bit. That was my first eight, my first. Who do I have to console? bend over a bar and indiscreetly fuck to get some coffee around here? Getting coffee, nice. Enjoy. But just because they're playing Belgium, I got interested. I see, yeah. Uh, Chelsea, Man City are coming to my state. I'd love to go, but don't know if I can afford. Interesting. Interesting. Are you a bit of a football fan or are you just curious? For those who don't know, we're trying to get the final 2,000 uh, euros we need to get the big taxi. It's like a bus. It's exclamation mark, merch, exclamation mark, if that's, uh, if you know what I mean. There is a reason for that, but um, we won't go into it now. Definitely one for the future, yeah. Yeah, he's, um, that goal against Liverpool. You've got to be brave, you know. I enjoy it. <laughs> so toxic. So toxic. If I had a mod here, Tira, I'd get them to ban you. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. Yeah, the merch is pretty nice looking, I've got to be honest. The artist did an amazing job. I like football. I've gone to MLS games, nice. Do you have an MLS team? Do you have an MLS team? I'd be very curious to know. Who do I need to ban? <laughs> you do. <laughs> you're all right, Zai, you're all right, you're all right. Tira used the uh, the S word, so uh, I was just teasing them. Columbus Crew, nice. Yeah, yeah. I, I I dabble, I dabble. I watch a little bit of MLS now and again. I mostly watch it when a huge European talent goes there. Um, like I think I watched when Zlatan was at LA Galaxy, when Thierry Henry was it was it the um, New York Red Bulls. Um, yeah, I'll always just see what what happens. I've watched a few uh, Messi games as well for. Um, my, uh, is it into Miami? So yeah, yeah. I 
I was just glad they didn't call the MLS like the World Series or something like that, you know? All right, how do we do? Four stars, not too shabby. Uh, not stopping red lights, speed limit breaks. Yeah, I'm not holding myself. Um, I'm not being too mad at myself if we don't get the speed limit related stuff because it. The th some places you've got to go 30 in this city and it's too slow. It's too slow. Uh, nice coffee mug. Thank you, I appreciate it. The crew just won last season, so people are still excited. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, I'll, um, I'll have to check them out sometime. I forgot to let you know, Platt. I got to drive again today. Really? I borrowed a friend's van. And even though it's basically a blizzard today. A, oh, my goodness. Oh, my good, A blizzard today. Jeez, Louise. Be safe, friend. Be safe. The, the, the amount of people have asked me to make a body pillow. It's, it's confusing to me. But, yeah, everybody wants me to. Well, everybody wants a TPL body pillow. The weather came out of nowhere. I bet you two passed each other on the street today. I bet you're next door neighbors and you didn't even know. You're not the first person that said body pillow. I'm not, I'm not even joking. You're not the first person that said it. Right, uh, who's next? We need another, I think 2,200. So should we do a challenge? Which, uh, which dial is challenge? Interesting architecture, no. I can't see any challenges on the map right now. Oh, there's one. There's one there. Carmen Romero, oh, it's an easy one. Uh... Oh, what about this one here? Actually, where are we? Yeah, that's not too bad. Is that a, that's a normal one. Okay. Let's see if we can get over to there. Oh, do you know what I'm going to do, actually? It's 8.50 p.m. in the game. So I think what I'll do is I'll go and sleep. Yeah, I think we'll sleep. Let me take you off as well. I've got too many lines on the map. What about you? Yeah, that won't be too bad. Yeah, we'll go there. Uh, we can all sleep with our own platinum. Fun tuning in. Def will be coming back to your stream. Have a great night, Nick. It's been a pleasure. Enjoy playing Taxi Sim. And if you've got any questions next week, I mean, you'll figure it out. I'm sure you're a smart person, but yeah. Uh, don't hesitate to ask. Have a good rest of your day. Right, so you want to go blue first, I think. Yeah. We're going to sleep. We're going to sleep. It's getting a bit dark, a bit dusky. So we're going to go sleep. Yeah, Nick is a walk-in that was, um, I think they just got this game. And they wanted to know about some of the management aspects. Um, as in buying more taxis, hiring people, I think. So yeah, quite a few people are picking this up and it's nice to see. The game has had two patches already and one of the patches really did fix the, um, the choppiness, the kind of frame issues. Eating now a romaine, hard egg, tomato cheddar, celery, pickled chicken, cashews. Cashews! Love me a cashew. That sounds very nice, Tyria. Sounds like a very good salad. I approve. I approve. If I haven't asked you yet, and this is for everybody, what's everybody's plan for the weekend? You've all been working hard. It's very nearly the weekend. We're guiding you through. Guiding you through, at least in the UK and Europe, the final few hours of uh, Friday. But what have you arranged on the weekend to bribe yourselves? What nice things are you doing? Kids have a birthday party, very nice. Zaya, enjoy the lurk. Kids have a birthday party. Will that be very stressful or is that going to be something very joyful? Maybe a bit of both, actually. I can imagine it being a bit of both. What age? That might decide whether it's stressful or joyful. Uh, now, if you're coming to sleep at my house tomorrow, so bye. Have a good weekend. Uh, we'll see you on, uh, hopefully see you on Monday. Have a good rest of your day.
Excuse me. Actually, it's fine. It's fine. I'm just going to very carefully break the law. It's okay to break the law, everybody, but you've got to do it carefully, you know. Oh, night shift on Monday. Oh, I see. We'll see you soon. Anyway, Johnny, we'll see you soon. I'm trying to maximize family time before taking off for a few days. Off for a few days in a few weeks. Oh, yes. I remember you telling me, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Heading to Philly for uh, WrestleMania XL. 8 and 11, not so stressful, fair. Prinny, welcome in Prinny. How's your day going, friends? Happy Friday. You're nearly there, Prinny. You're nearly at the weekend. So close. You can just reach out and touch it. Just about to go green, that's fine, I'm sure. Right, so the uh, garage is down here. We're gonna have a little sleep, I think. And in the morning, we need 2,000 and we can get the big taxi. The big taxi. Platt's doing very well. We're having a nice little relaxing Friday stream, a bit of lo-fi music, some taxi sim. Yeah, it's going quite nicely. How close are we? We're all heading the right direction, yeah. We're getting there slowly. So we take a left here and we'll be at the garage. And then we will, oh, big crash up ahead. Proper T-bone crash. Proper T-bone, let me go. Let me just ignore both of them and just nip down here. There we go. Yeah, that was a nasty looking crash. Okay, put the brakes on. Noise. I feel like I'm on a rock, boy. Uh, finish the task. Yeah, we're not going to finish the task. We'll do that tomorrow when we've got a bit more sunlight. Boom. Right, let's rest. Let's do it. Five thirty AM, so we'll go down to three. Rest. Eight thirty AM. Perfect. Beautiful. 
The non-assigned, the driver's got their salaries, minus 318. I've not been given money from them in a while. I don't know what days they work, but I've not been given any... I'm paying them their salaries, yeah, but like I'm not getting money from them at the moment. I wasn't expecting you to be able to buy upgrades in a realis realistic taxi game. So you can buy like better wheels, better engines, uh, but you can also buy other taxis. We're getting an empire. We, we have, um, including the one I'm driving, we've got three taxis now. So yeah, we, you can buy some pretty cool stuff. Actually, I've customized it to Platinum Lounge Blue as well. Uh, yeah, right. Who are we looking for? I think we're going to do a challenge. Might try and do two challenges. If they can give me a thousand each, um, we will have enough to get the next taxi. So we want to get the big taxi. want to get the big van, the six-seater van. That's what I'm looking forward to. And then we can take... Uh, because there are some jobs that are not available to us. Oh, the flying cars. Can we see? Are we seeing the flying cars? Yay, there they are. Yeah, it's wild. So yeah, some of the jobs uh, we can't do because our taxi is too small. So I want to do those jobs as well. I want to do all the taxi jobs. Truly a simulator of all time. Oh, yep, those cars are flying. Sorry, one second. Kensington, welcome in. Good to see you, friendo. How's everything with you? What's the plan for the weekend? Can you get a flying car, Tyria? That would be amazing. Sadly, unless the glitches get really, really, really bad. Yeah, they're only, only, only to be seen from afar. There's another one over there right now. Can you see it? It must be a known problem because it's, it's insane. Yeah, I've putting, been putting a lot of the glitches. Taxi Live 2077, yep. I've been putting a lot of the glitches on my YouTube actually. Um, for YouTube Shorts, so they're well worth a watch. I know it's very self-serving to say. I imagine, imagine that advertising my own stuff on my own stream, but still, um, it's very funny to watch some of the crashes, and some of the weird pedestrian behaviour. Yeah, and thank you to all the YouTube lurkers. We're trying to get three thousand YouTube watch hours so that we can become a YouTube partner. So thank you to everybody out there on YouTube. You are really helping. We've gone past 850 YouTube uh, watch hours now. Got to be live watch hours, not uh, YouTube shorts or anything. I've never been here before. So I like to think this is what it's really like. <laughs> yeah, this is what, this is the game. This is the game. Yeah, I really like a flying car. Okay. Uh, thank you. Is that, is that Prinny? I appreciate you, Prinny, if that's you. Thank you. It's, yeah, I figured it might be, but I appreciate you. Thanks. Yeah, I keep telling people we got a lot of kind of, um, like career lurkers in the community, which is great. I always tell people, if you're going to lurk anywhere, lurk on YouTube. But if you want to talk to us, come over to Twitch. This is 2011. Nice. I don't know when I, I've got my, my main one. I don't know when I had that since, but yeah, I like it. I like the name. Yeah, we could get to 900 next week, which would be lovely. I don't do any live streaming at the weekend, though.
Right, this is the next challenge. I think it's a normal difficulty. Oh my God, please. Right, let's see what this challenge is. It's probably gonna be a slow one if I had to guess. Because we've done quite a few speedy ones recently. Oh, you're in a hurry. Okay. We'll do a speedy one. Right. So don't kill us, but get there as quick as possible. I think that's the, that's the rule. Well, that was, that was pretty fucking close. Oh, red lights. Red lights. There we go, green lights. See, every for every second we're not going 40, I'm losing money. There we go. Oh, I think I was supposed to turn back there, fuck. Ah, don't waggle, don't waggle. Oh, how the fuck do I get? How do I get in? Oh, shit. I think I've messed it up. There was a little road I didn't see. And the camera's being weird. There we go. Not my best work, but we got there. We got there in one piece. How did we do? Two stars. Wow. That's, that's terrible. That is terrible. Yeah, that means slow. Literally the French taxi movie. I love the French taxi movies. I love them. Oh, Farah, hello. Good to see you, Farah. Um, Farah, just so you know, I spoke to Baz. It doesn't have to be today. We can start it next week, but they said they're happy for you to do German word of the day. So if you're happy with German word of the day, we'd be, be very happy to uh, have you as our ongoing German word of the day specialist. How's the YouTube progress, by the way? So we're up to 850 YouTube uh, watch hours now, live watch hours. So we're making good progress. Got to be 3,000 though. So yeah, plenty more, plenty more work to be done, but then I can be a YouTube uh, partner. I think there are two tiers of YouTube partner as well. So we'd be the lower tier, but the next highest tier is 4,000 hours. So it's not that much difference between three and four. Um, Mammoth session again, buddy. I think, I think we're actually getting quite close to the end. I wanted to try and get the next taxi before we um, end stream tonight. And we're quite close to that. Might need about, might to do, might need to do a couple more challenges. But um, yeah, we're on the way. How was your day, Farah? How's everything going with you? Uh, challenge, where's there another challenge? Should we try this one here? Might take a little while to get there. Yeah, the taxi movies were great. I think it was a trilogy. Um, I remember at the end, we used to watch them in school, in French class, at the end of the year, as like a reward. So yeah, that was good. Welcome in. Venator, welcome in. Thank you so much for the raid. Let me go over here. Raid. We're here to have a hoot. How are you? Ven raid. Uh, welcome in, Venator. Welcome in. Uh, Katie? Katie XO? How are you? Welcome in. Uh, Dave Behave. Horrible, P uh, horror, horrible Pete. Welcome in. I'm good, how are you? How's the taxi life? We've been doing pretty well today, actually. We're very close. We need about 1,500 more uh, euros to get the next taxi. Let me quickly play this, do some ventriloquism. Welcome in, raiders. If anybody needs to hydrate, get snacks, get away from screens, take your medications, please do. 
Self-care is very, very important. If it's anybody's first time here, why don't you tell me something about you? Let's get to know each other. Can you hear that okay over the lo-fi? Uh, tipsy, welcome in as well. Um, just to give you a quick insight into what we do here, we're a community full of people with chronic health issues, chronic pain, chronic fatigue, chronic illness, uh, mental health issues as well. And so, yeah, sometimes we like to play a sim game with lo-fi and just relax, talk about our issues, talk about our pains, our problems. And just um, today, we're just easing everybody into the weekend with some nice lo-fi and a very chill game. That's the plan. That's that's how we work here. Uh, Katie, am I saying that right? Let me know. Katie XO, thank you so much for the follow. Uh, but yeah, I'm from the UK. I stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, 6 p.m. GMT, um, 1 p.m. Eastern. So yeah, that's that's how we roll around here. We're just it's quite a relaxed vibe. I'm I'm yeah chief ill person, so people tend to find me through the chron uh, chronic tags. So yeah, we're, yeah, we're just quite laid back here. Uh, Katie, tell me something about you. Venator, let me give you a shout out before I forget. Are you good with video shout outs? I can give you the other kind if you prefer. But um, yeah, so we're playing Taxi Life, a city driving sim today. Has anybody played it? It's quite new. Uh, we're, um, we're trying to take over Barcelona by being the number one taxi company. That's not what they've told us, but that's what I choose to believe. Uh, but I cannot guarantee I won't be screaming. <laughs> we like them loud. Just making sure I got the spelling right for this. Where we? There we go. Did I get the spelling right for that? Oh, I put, yeah, I see what it did. I see what I did. One second, one second. <laughs> oh, it says your mum practically at the end of it. One second, there we go. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, it, we've been going for five and a bit hours here and it's the end of the week. My brain is slowly, slowly starting to dribble out of my ears. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. You, you saw nothing. Come on, there man. we go. Into space we go. It's an <laughs> yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Out you go. Come Iris, on, hello. Go. I'm lurking while playing some games. Hope everyone is well. Iris, lovely to see you. I was uh, enjoying the star starred you earlier. Um, it's good to see you, friend. Grabs popcorn, says Kensington. Right, let me uh, let me catch up. That's where I said your mum. Yep, yep, yep. Take two. Yep, 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 yep. I love that. Okay, all good. We're caught up. Yes, does anybody have any questions? I think I talked about myself. I did the ventriloquism thing. Yeah, so post, post stream care, please do it. Yeah, like I said, we're very chronic around here. So we believe in, uh, you know, taking care of ourselves, self-care. So that we need to do. Um, Katie, tell me something about you. Tell me something about you. Let's get to know each other. Where are you from? What kind of games you like to play? Um, yeah, it's lo-fi and taxi driving today. It's the plan. That is the plan. Which we're, So we're, um, like I said, we've currently got a fleet of three taxis, including the one we're driving. We've hired drivers for the other two. We're trying to get the big taxi. We're trying to get the big taxi by the end of the night. You're from Belgium. Now that is interesting because we were um, followed by somebody about 48 minutes ago, also from Belgium, but they now live in the UK. So we've been followed by two Belgians tonight, two native Belgians tonight. And I cannot remember the last time we were followed by Belgians ever. Um, so yeah, that's these things, it's like Noah's Ark around here. We've recently found out we've got two people in the community that have goats in their title. We've got two Johns. We've got two um, Queen of Belgium and Norway. Very nice. Yeah, that's that's a pretty good dominion. I respect that. And we've got two Ryans as well. So everything this week has been things happening two by two. I found out that one of our community has the, the same name as my sister. So that's two people with the same name again. It's been like Noah's Ark. We do do words of the day. I said do do as well. I said do do. I did it. I said it. 
but yeah if anybody has any questions about me oh okay that's that, that's a really good point actually so we've currently got people in the community it's not every day it does and when they're here we've got people that do swedish uh finnish german spanish english persian latin japanese uh I'm missing some, occasionally Irish as well, words of the day. Um, so yeah, as and when you're here, you just say, hi, I mean, when you come into chat, you know, when you arrive, you can just drop it in. Um, don't forget Welsh, we're not doing, I mean, you're gonna be strictly German now, Farah. Yes, because Baz, I had a word with Baz, and they said they're happy for you to do the German words. So we're going to just have you doing German words of the day because it will get too confusing otherwise. We may get somebody in the future that can also do the Welsh ones. But if it's all right with you, you can stick with the German ones. Have we had our German word of the day? Maybe you can show Katie how you do it. What do you think is your happiest memory? Jesus, really? I, <laughs> I don't, I have no fucking clue. <laughs> Every all the memories I have right now tend to be about um, like chronic related things. So off the top of my head, I, I can't. I've got, I've got truly got nothing for you. Flemish word of the day, frietkot. Sorry for the pronunciation. So what you need to do is you need to do that. That's all perfect. But then you need to do the, the definition after it as well. And I can copy it and drop it straight in the Discord. If anybody wants to join the, uh, the Discord, you can see all the other um, words of the day. Um. Uh. It's not irrelevant. It's not irrelevant, but you you can't you can't double dip, Farah. One person per per language. That's the that's the rules. Oh, okay, right. Let me so fruit cots. It's a place where you get fries and snacks. It's a huge thing here. Fantastic. So what I need you to do, if, you, if you're interested in actually seriously doing this, you don't need to. I mean, you've been here for two minutes. I don't want to put you to work immediately. But all the people who do words of the day will then whisper me the word of the day with its explanation as well. And I cut them all and I drop them into the Discord. So yeah, if, if you're interested, if you're interested, you can have the role if you want to. Uh, it's just the first question that popped into my head. It's a, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll think on it. I'll think on it. Uh, it's possibly the most the most Flemish word. Okay, well, it's good to start start strong. I like your style. Iris, how was your stream earlier? How are you doing today? We're hopefully going to get a new taxi. Uh, we're hopefully going to get a new taxi today. And we're going to get a big one. This is the um, this is the, probably the smallest taxi you can get, so we're going to get the six seater, and our our uh, taxi company will expand a little bit more. We'll have a little bit more. Uh, our domination will get you know continue in Barcelona. We're in Barcelona. Did I say that? We are in Barcelona. Um, we have accidentally killed a couple of people today. I think I did it. Thank you. You're doing great. Yeah, um, if anybody's in the Discord, you can go through. We've got words of the day from at least 10 different languages, including Persian. Bactrian does the um, Bactrian does the Persian word of the day. Um, and Indy does the Latin word of the day as well. So yeah, there's a whole crazy mix of words now. Yes, yes. One word, I mean, but always accidental. I didn't do it on purpose. But if you run people over, you get a 70 euro fine. And um, if you've got a person in the back of your taxi the, well, you'll go to like a black screen as well I love all our words of the day we've had a, um, we've also had Canadian slang as well Canadian slang word of the day a few times so yeah uh, Jakey hello welcome in first time chatter tell me something about you did you come in with a raid or are you a, are you a walk in Atlas does Spanish word of the day, Sam. Yes. I mean, are you thinking Spanish Grill? Because if Spanish Grill wanted to jump in and alternate with Atlas, I'm sure they'd be very welcome to. But Atlas does Spanish word of the day, yeah. Uh, dangle and step alternate uh, Japanese word of the day. I don't know that they necessarily know that, but they do. 
Welcome back. I was bored uh, looking for a game to buy. Is this, uh, do you like sim games? Uh, I'm gonna need to go, but thank you for the warmest welcome. Have a nice stream. Katie, I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Thank you so much for uh, coming in with the raid. Not from the raid, okay. So, well, yeah, tell me something about you. What kind of games you like to play? And uh, if you've got any questions about this one, I'd be happy to answer them. And if I think it's for you, uh, I'll let you know. Abby, Zaya got your package today. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, um, Irish, let me know how uh, how starred you went today. How are you enjoying uh, update 1.6? I starred you is something I would love to play. I have it. I actually have it on PlayStation because I think it was free one month. But I just, I've never played it. But one time I will get into it. Yeah, I, I play, it's not, it's nowhere near the same, but it kind of gives me the vibes of when I played um, Stranded Deep. When I was doing all my farming on my little tropical island while being attacked by boar and giant crabs and stuff like that. Yeah, very relaxing. But my relaxation mostly comes from Power Wash Sim or something like this. But I, I don't play those games in my spare time. I only stream them. And so uh, when we play them, we put on a little bit of lo-fi and just uh, have a nice relaxing time, you know. Sorry, it came so late. I, I doubt Zaya gives two shits how late it was. I'm sure Zaya's thrilled. Absolutely thrilled. Oh, I think we've got a turning coming up. I'd love to see you play Stargy. <laughs> Let me break here. So we're doing a challenge now. It's either going to be go very fast somewhere or go very slow somewhere. And it will give us, it, the challenges give us a lot more money than the normal journeys. So if we can get another one, is it like nine, 1,900 euros, we can get another tax. We can get the big boy. I think it might be the most expensive taxi as well, potentially. So yeah, I want to get that one. Oh, is it returning? No, not quite yet. Yeah, Leah did Irish Word of the Day once, really. Oh, is that the one I'm supposed to be going down? Have I, have I, I think we can just about salvage this. Yeah, we got an Irish Word of the Day once for Strawberry, I think. So yeah, really, and next time Riddy and Leah are here together, maybe you guys can do some alternating for uh, Irish Word of the Day. Easy now, easy. Some very narrow little areas in this game. Uh, this game quite expensive though, because new, um, so I think it'd be a bit cheaper. Yeah, it's not, it's very, very recently released. I think it's been out for like about three weeks yesterday. So it is quite new. Yeah, give it a little while. I'm sure the price will um, drop down nicely. One thing I can say is that I had some problems when it first came out. But thankfully, they've patched it twice already. And um, they patched one of my big issues straight out of the game. So that was helpful. But it's still got some problems, unfortunately. So the good news is for you, Jakey, by the time it's a price you want to buy it at, it'll probably be a little bit better anyway. <clears throat> the um, pedestrian AI is very, let's say, dodgy. And um, when I played it the first uh, I played it the day of release and the next day as well. And I was rear-ended, I think, 12 times across those two streams. No worries, Zaya. Rear-ended twice. And so, um, yeah, the AI in the cars and the pedestrians needs a little bit of work. So, yeah, by the time you get around to it, I'm sure it'll be crystal clean. Crystal clear, I should say, of uh, issues. We're getting a few flying cars today, Jake. So look to the skies and you might see some. <laughs> I'm not even joking. You might see something uh, interesting. Uh, uh, not sure if, uh, not sure if dodge, uh, if dodgy, if people drive like this, uh, I like this, not sure if dodgy, if people drive and like this, uh, I'll do strawberry then, add beer, G uh, today's German word, thank you, thank you very much, could you whisper it to me, Farah, that would be superb if you could. We've had quite a few words of the day today, and now I'll just pick them all up and uh, chop them in the Discord. Yeah, yeah, look to the skies. You never know, you might see a flying car or two. 
Uh, yeah, but Atlas does the Spanish words of the day. So I don't want to tread on Atlas's toes because it's um, it's Atlas's, Atlas's one. Um, what, are you thinking of um, blessing us, Sam, with some Spanish? Or a Spanish grill think you blessing us with some Spanish? I do one Spanish word of that. You can throw it in, Sam. It won't go in the um, the Discord, but you can throw it in if you want to. If you want to teach us something. So the car in front of us just then was from a rival taxi company. So I think they were trying to slow me down on purpose, sons of bitches. All right, nearly there. And nearly time for a challenge. I'm guessing it... Well, I don't think we've had a slow challenge recently. But um, you never know. From my school days, yeah, hit, hit us with it. Right, I've got to get over to there without being hit. Right, do they want to go quick or slow? I'm in a hurry. hurry. Get a right, let's go. Pedestrian. Oh, I hate these narrow ones for the for the speed challenges. Oh, don't tell me it's a red light. Not again. Oh. Pedestrian, get the fuck out of the way. Oh, still on the pavement. Jesus Christ, that was close. Whew. All right. More red lights. More red lights. Why are you doing this to me, game? Yeah, as you can probably imagine, the handling isn't quite up to GTA standards, but oh shit, is it this one? Oh, I've taken oh, I've taken the fucking slowest route possible, I think. All these little side roads. Oh. Yeah, I should have stuck on the motorway. Not the motorway, the main road. How are you supposed to do these <laughs> when there's so many cars on the road? Oh, move. Try not to crash. Oh, fuck. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I think we fucked it. Yeah, ran out of time. I don't know where this place is. They're, they're sending me in fucking circles. I think I had to go all the way around, like spiral, 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 and get into the middle. Oh. Yeah, I think I fucked that one up royally. Oh. Easy, easy, easy. I'm gonna get if I do manage this some by some miracle, there's gonna be no tip left, that's for damn sure. No, it was right there. 
It was right there. Oh, God damn it. I can't remember how to spell it. I don't want to butcher the word for I play Crazy Taxi. Um, a long, long, long time ago. I've seen the trailer for the reboot, though, that's coming out next year. And I think I'm going to play it. It looks pretty sweet. Oh, God damn it. That was so annoying. Yeah, I think I must have taken some hideous wrong turns. It just seemed to never end. I needed to be a bit more illegal. I might have to, next time I do one, I might need to look at the map. Um, I just plot a route first. I don't know if that costs me time or anything, but I need to get a good route. I'll try another one. Fast or slow? Oh, it might be the same person with the same journey. Yeah. Wait a minute. So if I t if I turn around, what do we think? If I if I can I immediately turn right? Let's see if I can do. I'm probably, probably going to get hit by a car if I do this. But So much traffic. Oh, can I squeeze through just about? Oh, ride the pavement, ride the pavement, ride the pavement. Fuck. <laughs> God. <laughs> that was that was close. That was very close. Yeah, I think this is the way to do it at least. We were we were pointing the wrong way to start with, I think. There we go. That's how you do it. That's how you do that. Okay, how do we do? Three, only three stars. Oh my God, what do these people want from me? Game seems smoother now. Yeah, they patched it on Tuesday. We've not had any of that chunk loading. It's uh, a lot smoother now. What? Are, I mean, how could I possibly have done that any quicker? Yeah, but you said break all the rules. You said you didn't mind if I broke all the rules. I suppose it was difficult easy though, wasn't it? Yeah. To try and find a more difficult challenge. What are you up to? Nine and a half thousand. Hmm. Maybe we'll find another challenge another time. Let's see if there's anybody we can raid out to. Yeah, we got the platinum on a Wednesday, I think. If anybody wants to grab that, you're more than welcome to. Uh, we're back on Monday with Rise of Ron. Not Rise of the Ronin, Rise of Ron. Oh, really looking forward to it. Uh, and then towards the end of the week, we're doing Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League next week as well. Uh, I've never raided this person before, so we'll see what they're about. Um, have a good weekend, everyone. And uh, yeah, yeah, see you on Monday. <laughs>